session of Dungeons and Dragons, a custom campaign, Armageddon, the War of God. So joined again by the same group of guys. We're going to be continuing. And actually, I'm going to pass it off to Alan, our DM, who's going to kind of give you a, a quick brief on where we're at in the story and campaign. All right. So kind of to start off, uh, you guys just started off in uh, the on the high road. You guys were on the way to Neverwinter. You guys were uh, in captive. You guys were captive by guards. And we're going to go to the Neverwinter jail. And then uh, a voice spoke to you and told you that uh, the gods are trying to overthrow uh, Mount Olympus and then you and then the col and the kobolds were on their way to come and attack you so you and the guards uh, tried or you and the guards killed the kobolds in the process you guys killed the guards at the same time <laughs> which is fine <laughs> um, so then you guys were you know pretty much free so you guys took the caravan or you guys met Hades uh, who told you to stay away that you guys were nothing but mere mortals and that you guys couldn't kill him uh, so then you guys, uh, after that he went away, you guys took the uh, caravan back to Neverwinter. Uh, you guys went to Neverwinter, got through the guards, fine at the front, none of them noticed you. And then you guys went to the uh, tavern, where Tadek <laughs> got very, very drunk. Yes, yes he did. Uh, you guys spoke to people there. Um, yes, he did. <laughs> you got some, some, some idea of what the town is like. Uh, and then uh, you guys ran into a uh, cultist who you guys killed with the Superman Tonic Punch. <laughs> the random across the room. Uh, after that, you guys went ahead and uh, went up to bed, and then you guys were sent out, it was already got set up to find the hidden temple of Hades. Um, and you guys, after running into the city hall where you, where Yari tried to sneak disguise in. himself and sneak <laughs> in and completely failed. Uh, you guys knocked out a guard, and the other guard let you guys go, letting you guys know kind of where the hidden temple was, where he thought it was. Uh, you guys checked it out, find where the hidden temple was, and now you guys went down to the hidden temple. Now, was that the one with the lance in him, right? <laughs> I'm pretty sure we threw a lance to one of them. Javelin. Yeah, the yeah, javelin. javelin. <laughs> no, you threw yeah. the javelin at the knocked out one. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> After he was knocked out. <laughs> I hope that guy's all right, because he was in bad shape. <laughs> May or may not run into him eventually. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, geez. All right, so I kind of gave you guys a description of the room that you guys were in. I'll go ahead and do it again because for refresh. Um, so as you guys climb down the ladder into the hidden temple of Hades, uh, you can see, you guys are in a room. Uh, the south and the west walls have been engraved with demonic rituals. Uh, torches surround the walls, creating light. The temple smells a mix of dust and grease and something vaguely metallic. It smells like you're underground. The feeling of a dark essence is now stronger making the hair on your arms stand on end. Spooky. <laughs> so we're just like perpetually like with our hair yeah. arms standing out. <laughs> spider it's, sense. It's yeah. giving you a shiver. Spider it feels very, it feels like there's definitely a strong evil going on in this temple. So I'd, I'd like to just look around, see what we can see right out of the gates. Oh uh, yeah, just throw me in a perception check. Okay. Uh, let's set this guy down. Nine. Um, two, so eleven. Uh, no, you, nothing really interesting. You can just kind of you kind of tell that this is kind of just the entrance of the uh, temple. Uh, like so the demonic, uh, the demonic engravings were etched by kind of like a weapon of some sort. Uh, but you don't know what they what they say. Does anybody have good investigation? Maybe we can see if we can tell what those etchings are. What they say. Oh, by the way. Um, they are well, well, kind of good looking for things. <laughs> Would it be? No, it wouldn't be investigation. What kind of uh, role would we want to do? I believe that. What are you guys trying to do? If we are, if we're trying to read what's on the wall, uh, we wouldn't be able to unless we we're. Isn't that just an intelligence check? Uh, no, because you, you you don't know the language. Oh yeah, so we, we yeah. can't. You can't read it. Okay, okay. It's, right. it's Chinese. So what do you guys want to do? Is there how many doors are in this? This one. Uh, so there is a door to the south west, a door right next to it, uh, and then there's a door to the north, uh, west, or northeast. So left uh, right. Both, uh, the two are the, uh, the one at the, on the north is just like a, just a wooden door, um, and then, are oh, they're all wooden doors. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. 
Hey, I get a bad feeling about this. Uh, I'm going to try and get this guy to go first. <laughs> hey, it's whatever, man. We can do. <laughs> I'll go first, definitely. Yes, yes, let's like go. Okay. Yeah, I'll go first. Fearless <laughs> warrior. <laughs> you can go through the door. <laughs> All right. All right, so, so you're going to go north. first. Which one? Uh, northwest. The northwest one? All right, so uh, northwest, you're uh, just a just a stuck wooden door. So you can't, you, you, go to, you go to open it, and you can't quite budge it. You can't just easily open it. It's not locked. Is there a lock? Yeah. Uh, it doesn't seem locked, but it doesn't, it just seems like it's kind of stuck. Let, let me have a, a There's door. There's no lock on the door. <laughs> oh, can punch. I'm going to punch the door. <laughs> All right, roll me uh, an athletics check. Six. <laughs> uh, Alright, so you, roll. Yeah, it does. Um, yes. So you go to, did you try and kick it down? I punched it. You punched it? So you go to punch it and it just doesn't budge whatsoever. <laughs> no crack, nothing. I, I didn't do my meditations before <laughs> this. Uh, <laughs> you can concentrate, come on, what are you doing? Alright, so. You guys want to try the other door? <laughs> I guess so. All right, so I'm gonna wander over to the other door. Uh, which one? You have the south, uh, east, and southwest wall. Southwest. All right, the southwest wall uh, is locked. Wow, why do they have the cardinal directions backwards? That's weird. Like north is now south, and south is now north. I just realized that. Um, so the it's uh, it's a locked door. Did I try to pick the lock? Uh, yeah. Is that a sleight of hand? No, that's my that's my, hand, that's my yeah. proficiency. Uh, so Eighteen. All right. Yeah, you're able to. Actually, you were not able to unlock it. Ooh. Right. So wow. wait, it's these tools is your roll plus. It's just a roll, and then if you plus proficiency, you get plus two, and then plus anything else. Is it not plus dex? I don't think so. Mm, okay. Eighteen. Then, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Can we kick down the door? Are you sure to try? I'll <laughs> get it all the way. I'm gonna kick this door down. Uh, 18 uh, plus so four or 19? Uh, yeah. So you uh, lean back and you kick the door and it just bursts right open. There you go. You lucky. <laughs> you lucky. Right. That's lucky all it foot. was. This is the lucky foot. I could have done that. All right, so uh, you kick the door down. Uh, as you enter the room, you can see a wooden platform uh, in the southeast corner of the room. Uh, there are tables lining the west wall uh, with scrolls and books cluttering the space. A pile of trash lies in the east side of the room. Can I see what are in the scrolls and the books? Uh, yeah, give me a intelligence check. Intelligence? Or give me a... It doesn't matter, it's a 10 anyways, either way. You're not able to, you're not, it just looks like uh, demonic etchings in the scrolls. I like to go dig through the trash. <laughs> of course, of course, of course he goes through the trash. Oh yeah, that, I dug through okay, that trash. trash boy. Uh, 19, <laughs> I think it's just 19. Uh, for investigation? Okay. Yeah. All right, yeah, so you dig through the trash, you guys are throwing it over, just making a big mess here. At the bottom you can see two healing potions. I'll take those. I'll right. throw those away. <laughs> Who's laughing I now? I think I'm still laughing, Trash Boy. <laughs> <laughs> the smell won't deter monsters. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> It'll deter everything. Grab a couple things in my bag here. Alright, what else? I'd like to go look at the, uh, the platform in the corner. Uh, the platform? Yes, yes. yes. Alright, uh, what are you gonna, do you just kind of look to kind of see what it is? Or? Yes, yes. Alright, so as you, at the moment. uh, just give me an investigation. It would be 15. Alright, so you're able to see that there is a latch on this, uh, Ooh. on this door. Is it locked? Uh, no, it doesn't seem locked. I'm going to go ahead and pull on it. Alright, so, uh, as you open it, um, you can see there's kind of just like a small little room here at the bottom of it. Uh, and you can see that uh, two cultists seem to be working on some potions that they're making, um, and uh, two winged kobolds are just in the corner feeding, feasting on a, a human body. Do they uh, see me yet? Uh, no. No? And how are they arranged? Just like, are, are certain yeah, so ones ahead of, ahead of other ones? 
I'm going to go ahead and close the hatch. Here, so <laughs> I'm going to close the hatch uh, and go over to Trash Boy and tell him <laughs> that hey, man, there's some people. Hand in here. <laughs> you see this stuff? Look, <laughs> you, can close the place. <laughs> you can have that to yourself. Sweet. <laughs> I don't like banana peels. <laughs> oh, they're the best. There are some people down there. Uh, they look like they're making potions of some sort. And there's also a couple monsters, so I think uh, that might be a good place to possibly get some information. Yeah, that makes sense. I found a few potions at the bottom of this garbage, man. It was great. You want to see here? Have one. I'll yeah, give you a potion. I'll take, I'll take you. I'll take you potion. There you go. All right. <sighs> Thank I you, guess, Trash I mean, Boy. <laughs> so, I guess, what do you want to do? Um, we should probably go in there and steal the potions from the guys that are making them. You guys think that's a good idea? Sounds like a lot of work. It is a lot of work, but... Who knows? It might be some cool stuff. All I know is I'm not going in first this time. Okay, I'll go first. <laughs> okay, yes. I'll jump right down there. Now once we you get know, the layout down, I feel like I have a plan. I have a plan. It's great. <laughs> yes. But <laughs> it's the greatest plan. You'll have, have, have to tell us what this plan is. This is the best plan. All so right. far, your plans have not been the greatest. <laughs> so this is where uh, you guys entered in. Uh, these are the two tables with the scrolls on them. This is the trash, and then that's the uh, door that you just okay, opened. Okay, okay. Well. Now, are the monsters behind the cultists? Or are the uh, monsters... Where are you guys located on the... Uh, I well, where's it? So this he is was the trash. trash boy. I'm right here. He was here. I was over here, and then I went to tell Trash Boy, <laughs> and I'm right here, so they can both hear me. All right. And uh, yeah. Um. Oh, what was your question? So the order, like, are the monsters behind the cultists? From what I saw, where where are they? Okay. So you have so uh, when you're looking down towards like just. Cup is just north. Uh, they were making their potions at a table, and then the uh, two winged kobolds were in the same nor north corner, feasting on a body. But further? Yeah. So it's okay. Okay. it's more of like a, for a rectangle room. shaped room, and they're over at the other end. Okay. I think I think we should slowly open the hatch. I'll jump down, try and get a drop on them. And then I'll punch them, try and kill them in one hit. Stealth attack. Yes. Stealth oh, attack. Yeah. All right, so you're gonna I like go that. <laughs> try and stealth attack them. I will too. Okay. I'll, I'll go down there with you too, because there's two of them. Yes. So you is. do one, I'll do the other. Okay. Wait. Why don't I also go down there? Well, we want, we're all going down there. Yeah. There's four. I mean, there's uh, four. You're gonna throw Peelus on there too. Peleus. He's four, gonna be yes. just kind of with you guys. He's just gonna kind of walk with you. Peleus is gone this week, by the way. Yeah, Peleus yeah. uh, was not able to make it. Uh, okay? So yeah. I am going to be running Peleus' character, because uh, I did not uh, have enough time to switch the encounters, and you guys all would have died. So, <laughs> Alright, I'm going to run him for this We're week. Make it work. I like not dying. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Wouldn't that just be the best way? Week two, everyone <laughs> dies. Just game over. Thanks a lot, Peleus. <laughs> oh, if we if someone dies, he's, he's getting it. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so you guys are going to try and jump down? Stealthfully. stealthfully. Yeah, stealthfully. All right, uh, all three of you or just yeah. two of you? All okay, three. Okay. All right, everyone roll stealth checks. Getting good. Wow. It's all right. It's still good. I have high stealth. Oh! <laughs> I got better than you Seven. guys. Six. Eleven. Wow. Ooh, what? they're going to eat us. Six stealth. Really? Yeah. Dang. I'm pretty stealthy. I have plus five. I have plus four. But I have four. You got eleven, yeah. eight, and six? Yeah. All right. Uh, I think they know we're here. <laughs> No, I, I didn't get Who knows, they could be very, very busy. Yeah, I got seven. So the kobolds, <clears throat> kobolds and the cultists know that you're here. Ah. Um, the cultists know that you're here. The, oh. the kobolds just only seem to notice him. And then they can see, none of them can see you. Perfect. I so you're kind of in the front. <laughs> you're in the front there where they can see you. And then he's kind of... Kind of in the corner where they can't, the cultists see him, but the wing, wing kobolds don't. And then you are just hiding. It's because I am just yeah. so broad, so powerful. <laughs> I'm literally <laughs> hiding behind you, like 
<laughs> My scrawny brother. I'm hiding him. I'm behind him. I'm going to go ahead and switch dice. <laughs> Alright, so. Oh no. Oh yeah, did Helios jump down with us? Yes. No. Okay. Uh, did yeah, he make roll. it? <laughs> Is he dead? Everyone knows Helios. Oh, he rolled 19, they can't see Oh, <laughs> oh okay. so nice. He's definitely <laughs> sneaking around. Um, I'm going to check his stats, he's rolled 19. Oh, I need this. That would be helpful. Cool. I like the ambiance of thunder we have going on outside. <laughs> it sounds very nice. Uh, they probably can't hear it on stream, though. No. <laughs> Unfortunately. It just it makes it very like, ominous. Yeah. Which ones are the cultists? The tall ones? Uh, no. So the cultists are the pawns, and then the wing, wing cobalts are the, uh, what are they? The bishops. bishops. Yeah. The bishops. Can I shoot one of the cobalts with my bow? Uh, uh yes, you can. I can just go straight into that? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna I do that. I didn't like the look on it. I'm gonna, like, I'm yes. gonna if you around. save stealth, and they all, then you get a go a free turn if you're okay. stealth from everybody. So I'm going to peek around Tarek, pull out my bow, and just shoot an arrow. Alright. And that's uh, 15 to hit. Uh, yep, that'll hit. Yeah, first hit. Oh. 10 damage. Alright. Oh boy. Crush. And so you, you pull it up your bow and you shoot it. And the wing cobalt kind of hears the, kind of turns around and <laughs> falls over dead. Perfect. <laughs> okay. So that, so that one. Easy. They might have heard yeah, that one. They might have heard that one. Hey, this goes with the thought. You guys can still hear the thunderstorms over the city. There it uh, is. Oh, yeah, the city hall. Yeah. <laughs> way, to, way to bring that in. It was all planned. Yeah, all right, and Peleus gets to go. So Peleus, uh, if you just want to move him for me, yeah, Tonic, yeah, uh, he's going to walk up to one of the cultists. The one on the left. And he's going to attack. Uh, roll natural run. Uh, so he takes out his uh, great sword and goes to attack. And the uh, cultist kind of hears him run up, kind of turns around, kind of ducks out of the way as it hits and gets stuck into the table. Classic Peleus. Classic Peleus. <laughs> All right, and everyone roll for initiative. Ooh, okay. No way, he's. Looks like I'll be going again. <laughs> Seven. Seven oh, plus you suck. <laughs> Three. Okay, ten. Alright, so, um, Tarek? It's, uh, fifteen. Peleus. I forgot I got roll for him, too. Roll a seven. And Reinhardt? Ten. Yeah. Twenty. Again, classic feeling. I don't know who's gonna go first, but uh, <laughs> yeah. Yachty goes it's first. Yeah. Um, okay, so after my successful first shot, I'm going to pull another arrow from my quiver and step. Can you put, move me over one? And step to the side mm -hmm. and fire another arrow at the cobalt. All right. Roll for attack. That is a 14 to hit. That'll hit. And. Five damage. All right. Cool. <clears throat> so you take your bow and you yep. take it out of your quiver, pull back and shoot it. It just hits the cobalt right in the shoulders. <laughs> kind of looks at you now, very angry. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Come in, right. bro. These things sound very angry. All right. Sounds and after the yachty is Tadek. All right. I'm going to run up to the cultist that Peleus tried to hit. On the list, you're going to attack the left one. Yes. Okay. Roll for attack. I'm going to punch him two times. Two times? First one is 16 to hit. Uh, that'll hit. Uh, second one is 
15 to hit. Both will hit. And that is 10 damage. Alright, and... <laughs> so you, so you, uh, you run up to him, he kind of turns around, you give him a good punch in the face, kind of knocks him back a little bit, and you do your left uppercut, knocks him up, and his head just gets stuck in the ceiling. <laughs> and he's, uh, he's dead as well. If you want to knock him over real quick. He's out for the count. <laughs> yeah, he was right. way <laughs> off the And after Tonic is uh, Reinhardt. Alright, I'm going to charge up to the Cobalt, and I'm going to swing at him. Alright, go ahead and roll for attack. <laughs> Fine. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's that plus your... I it doesn't matter. Yeah. 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 This is fine. <laughs> Alright, so you run up to him, kind of run with your shield in front of you, and you go to attack, and you forget your shield's there, and you whack at your shield. <laughs> oh, yeah! It's the best! <laughs> Alright, and after uh, Reinhardt is uh, Pelias, and Pelias is going to attack the Cobalt to the right, or the Cultist to the right. Ooh, and he is going to hit. Wow. He's waiting to my disadvantage. Oh, there we go. Uh, he rolled like a 19 earlier. <laughs> okay, that's true. 10 damage. Oh, that's a bad okay, dice. Okay, this is a good dice. He does 10 damage, so he, won, he uh, just kind of kind of takes his bonus action to rip the uh, the great sword out of it. Well, hitting it back, comes up and slings it down and cuts the cobalt or the cultist straight in half. I learned my lesson again. I was just going to be classic Velia. <laughs> play, 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 play him better than Mike. <laughs> <laughs> classic Velius. All right, and after Pelias is now the enemy's turn, which is only one kobold left. And he's actually not going to move before I knock down that cultist. He's going to uh, attack you for... Uh, kind of look, kind of looks at you. And then goes to attack you. It's kind of confused why you hit your own shield. <laughs> He rolls for attack, and with his dagger, and that's 15. Nope. All right, so he goes with his dagger, kind of gives kind of a slash and misses, and now back up to the top at Yachty. <laughs> All right, so after my success, I'm going to move back one spot and attack the Cobalt again with my longbow. And that is a 10 to hit. Uh, and so... Take your quiver, you take your arrow, kind of sh take it back and kind of go to shoot it. You sneeze, <laughs> and it hits the floor. Dang. It's kind of monkey or mu musky in the. Yeah, in this. It's even kind of monkey. Down here. <laughs> it's it's kind of monkey. Kind of monkey it's down down here, guys. Monkey's it's over here. The monkey all of a sudden. All right, and after Yachty is Tarek. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to punch him two more times. Uh, uh, 21 to hit and 11 to hit. Whew, uh, well, the first one hit. And that is 8 damage. Alright. So you, um, so you did two fists. So you go and you, you kind of go to punch him and he moves his head. And you come up with an uppercut and hit him right there. So it goes, and his neck comes back and he falls to the ground and he's dead. Woo! Yeah. Very good at the uppercut. <laughs> That's my go-to. <laughs> That's your go-to. Just the whole one. I, can, I confuse them with the first miss and then, <laughs> and then go for the uppercut. Um, Always catches them off guard. And that is the encounter. Um, what are you guys gonna do now? Can we search for the potions there? Potions. See if we can grab some of those. Yeah. Uh, given. Uh, men. Yeah, yeah just do an investigation check. Nine. Uh, you go to look at the potions. Uh, they kind of are kind of bubbling and smoking. Mm -hmm. um, and you go to kind of look at them and you knock one over and it just starts burning through the, the wood. Oh, cool. Can I, so, uh, careful. Can I do a medicine check on... The other one that he did not knock over? Uh, he knocked, no, he knocked, he knocked all the potions over. Oh, all over. of it. Oh, it was oh. just, it was Way all to go, just, man. Oh, it was just a chance, guys. That could have been useful. We could have melted the lock. Oh, I'd Shoot. like to, I'd like to, what do I, what do I want to do, guys? I want to look around the room. Uh, just this room? Yeah, I want to see if there's anything else we can see. Oh, uh, yeah, give me a perception check. <laughs> Natural one. 
Yeah. Yeah. Um, so as you're looking around, you're kind of looking around, and as you look up, and you kind of see it's, it's a dirt ceiling, and dirt kind of comes up and or comes down and gets in your eyes. Oh, yeah, it's the best. <laughs> Maybe we should get that in here. Yeah, let's get out of here, yeah. man. All right, so you guys are going to climb up the ladder? Yes. yes. All right, so you guys are uh, climb up the ladder from the, uh, kind of the, it's kind of like a bunker down there, um, and what do you guys, uh, the, the entrances are marked with the non-walls. Let's, uh, let's go through this one that's right next to the, the platform. Okay, yeah, so you guys uh, go through there, that's just a regular door. That's the closest. It needs to, uh, just a simple unlock door. And then as you guys go into that room, uh, you open the door and you find the floor is covered in, uh, is covered in cracked square tiles, altering between white and black. Uh, the room is very dark, and a and, uh, rot, a rotten odor fills the room. This uh, looks like a stinky jet board. It reminds me of the kitchen at the temple. <laughs> you guys can see rotted body parts in the southeastern oh, <laughs> corner of the room. Uh, blood is streaked along the walls on, on the east wall. There is something written in flesh blood. All hail flesh Hades, flesh blood. ruler of the underworld. <laughs> can you guys see that? That's, that, that shit is crazy. It's flesh blood, man. <laughs> it's It seems very flesh. It's so drippy. <laughs> what in the world is going on down here? I saw this in a movie once, guys. I think this is a trap. Or one of those moving picture shows. Hey, uh, is there any doors in the room? Uh, yeah, so in this, uh, there's um, two... Can you do left to right there's... instead of cardinal directions? Uh, yeah, there's two to the north and one to your right. <laughs> <laughs> well, how, I don't know what direction I'm facing. Two okay, directly so in front two, of us? Two, one directly in front of you, two to the left. Thank you. Okay. So, uh, wooden doors, and is there anything of interest like inside of the room? Any tables, something like that? The uh, one in front of you is a wood. Uh, there are other yeah, wooden doors. Oh, okay. Can so, I, uh, <coughs> can I see if I can figure out what killed the the bodies? Uh, yeah. Give me a. Or investigation. Medicine. <laughs> medicine check. Medicine check to see if they're alright. No, no, no. Well, see like, if I can medicine determine what, to see. what killed them. Yeah. Yeah. Is it medicine to check what killed them? Yeah. I, I right, that's, that's, that's fine. If you, I don't know. That makes sense. 20. Um, yeah, so you're able to see that. Um, oh boy, what's next? What's next? Oh no. I'll give you some. Uh, so it looks like some daggers, uh, it's just like nice clean cuts, uh, and kind of tell like the, the uh, parts were ripped out, and then uh, um, some of the parts are missing from the body. Uh, pancreas is missing, the stomach is missing, and there is no heart. They sound none, like none of them are. <laughs> no, no, no. Ooh. Can I make a? Uh, can I see if I might know of any evil rituals that would include those things? Uh, History check. Ten. <laughs> uh, no, you don't. Dang. You you know it's for a ritual, but you're not exactly sure what ritual it's for. Okay. Do we? What are the people wearing? Uh, it's just normal traveling clothes. Just something like just they're like common villagers. Folk. Not yeah, they're just, not like just common folk. No. Okay. okay. Did we hear if there's any guards missing? Hell, or if we knew missing people were in the town? Uh, no. I don't remember. Okay. Uh, well, this is suspicious. Most definitely. I think we should leave this room very quickly. Yes, I agree. Don't like it, Neil. We should check the doors left to right. Yeah. Just go left to right. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's, let's check the first one on the left. All right. First one left. That is a um, another door that uh, doesn't have a lock on it, but it's stuck. I'm gonna bash it with my arm. With my fist. With, with your arm or your fist? Like this well, or like this? With my arm fist. <laughs> with my arm fist. <laughs> Alright, uh, give me uh, a flash check. That 20. Uh, yeah, so you you do like, so you go to punch it and you punch it with your hand. It doesn't break it, but then you're kind of arm. You do an arm <laughs> fist and it just completely just breaks right open into this next room. Which is four here. 
and uh, when you break through the door, you see four cultists writing demonic symbols on the east wall with bloody hands. On the west wall, you see two limp bodies leaning against the wall with their throats cut and bellies gutted. You know one of the bodies to be uh, Satel Doon, the wife of the bartender at the Shimmering Mermaid. The cult, as you burst through the door, the cultists look at you, and everybody will for initiative. <laughs> Nice to use. Ooh, oh, man, twenty. It's your boy. It's your boy. <sighs> Let's see. Let's oh yeah. boy. <clears throat> you we haven't lost any HP. I don't want to get hit. No, 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 no. We've been doing it. <laughs> if you keep pushing. punching doors down, we're going to have some problems. <laughs> yes. That's my thing. <laughs> I'll show you the way of the fist, man. No, oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Let me show you the way of the fist, man. What was that noise? <laughs> That's my battle cry. <laughs> 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 Right before I show them the way of the fist. <laughs> 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 you want to see the way of the fist? <laughs> very interesting. <laughs> right, well, I am a very right interesting man. man. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I don't think we mentioned that we have a special guest. Alan's back. Yeah, Alan's <laughs> Welcome. Reverse <laughs> Alan. It's a real nice... Uh, where did you guys come in from? Where did you come in from? Reverse Alan. The first row on the left. Oh, I know. Okay, so it's the bottom. Right. Let's see here. And then the... Two dead bodies are... Uh, yeah, it should be over here. Alright. Brian Hart will be in first. Oh, hey! In front, because he broke through the door. Sometimes I don't know my own strength. We're not technically in the room yet. Yeah. What'd you no. say? We'd be right behind him. Okay. Yeah, we're walking. Uh, right, right, right behind him. And peel over there. <laughs> peel over there. <laughs> All right, uh, Tarek. Oh, your initiative. Oh, uh, 18. All right, uh, Reinhardt? Minus 10. Got it. 24. And between, uh, Tarek and Kidius, who do you want to go first? Uh, I'll go first. Okay. Since Pelius You're here. is not here. Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, so, uh, first up is Yachty. That's right, I am. Of course you are. Um, you move me one space forward, and I'm going to attack the one closest to me. So I'm just going to meet you. Nope. Oh, oh, yeah, right there, that guy. And I'm going to, oh shoot, I didn't grab my arrows from the last <laughs> room. I'm down some arrows now. He's, he is I gotta remember that. They always tell you, you must pick those up. <laughs> I just forget, I get so into the battle, I don't, I don't remember. <laughs> so, I'm going to uh, pull out another uh, arrow from my quiver, pull back and just shoot. Uh, shoot, shoot with the long ball. <laughs> shoot, shoot. And a 10. Uh, 10 does not hit. Hmm. Cool. So you take your bow back and you shoot, the guard or the cultists were totally ready for it, and they all kind of just Matrix goes, goes evasive action. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it kind of goes through two of them, it goes, moves, and the other one moves its other head like that, and it just goes right through. Son of a bitch, what the hell? And after uh, Yadi is Todd. Alright, I am going to run up to them, the one closest to the group, and I'm going to punch him, but I'm going to use a key point and uh, use flurry of blows. All right, that's so one text. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho. <coughs> uh, the lowest to hit is nine, uh, 18. Uh, all of those are going to hit. Oh, ho, ho. 
you want to hit? Uh, I guess. Oh, whoops. Do you want to hit multiple or just one of them? We'll, we'll hit the one next to him too, I guess. Okay. Do you, do you want two on the first one and yeah. one on the second one? Yeah. Okay. So roll uh, the first two first. Uh, thirteen. All right. So. And then the second one? Uh, six. Alright. So you, uh, you run, so you run up to these guys, you go quick one, two, and just kind of and it's kind of branded, or his head just kind of pulls open and it falls to the floor. The other one like, goes, what the t and you go and punch him square in the face. He kind of looks stunned for a little bit, but he's, he's ready to attack you back. Cool. And, Man, I'm uh, awesome. <laughs> after Tarek is Felix. Uh, he's going to move over to the one that you just attacked. Oh, uh, yeah, the, the front one's dead. And he is going to attack with his great sword. Uh, that'll hit. And so he goes to attack him, takes his great sword, lifts it up over his head, comes down, and Cuts it, it kind of cuts it back, discultus in half as well, and just kind of goes, ah! <laughs> kind of sits there for a moment, and then slowly just <laughs> falls. Pelius, yeah. Oh, <laughs> no. Signature move. All right, and he falls over. Well, he falls <laughs> both ways. Yeah. He's got an half. Uh, and after Pelius is Reinhardt. Uh, I'm going to attack this cultist. All right, I'm going to run up to him. 14, 17. 70 to hit, that'll hit. With 8 damage. 8 damage. Nine. Oh, 9. 9 damage. damage. Alright. So you run up to him, run up to him and kind of do kind of like a, just a quick jab and it gets him right in his throat. And just wait for blood to drip down his mouth and he just falls over. Yeah, man. Whoa. Yeah. We're just tearing through like I've seen what? that somewhere before. <laughs> All right, and after Reinhardt is damn, always get I only get one one character. Maybe <laughs> okay, we should roll higher. It was just too good. <laughs> yeah. Don't you know who we are? <laughs> Don't you know us? And attacks, attacks you, you for attack. For... Nobody knows who you are. We're the infamous group now. He's going to attack Reinhardt for jabbing his friend into the throat. Yeah, right. You know, not for uh, not Peleus for. Cutting his friend in half, <laughs> or me for punching his Ooh. friend's face to oblivion. <laughs> will, punching his face will off. Will 22 hit? Yes. Oh, okay. I wasn't 100% sure. If 22 did not hit it at level 2, uh, that's 5 damage. So he comes up to you, he goes, <gasps> Come and he gives you a big gash on your shoulder. Oh no! <laughs> he taps you and then kind of. Looks at you and you, see, you seem really angry. <laughs> kind of cowers a little bit. And after yeah. that, back at the top with Yachty. Yeah. I'm going to attack him with my bow. Shoot, do that. Um, I'm going to. A after he's attacked him, I'm going to go. Hi. He looks right at you, kind of confused. And then as he looks at me, we make eye contact. I let go of the arrow and uh, I roll 18 to hit. Alright. Damage. Um, seven. All right. Seven so damage. he kind of looks over at you. He kind of notices what you're doing and kind of moves his head like this. And you shoot and you hit him right in the shoulder. Comes out the other side completely and it's just <laughs> bleeding. Perfect. He did seven damage. He's, wait, he's not. We didn't do he's damage yet. Oh, okay. he's not dead. Okay. I thought we already did damage yet. Oh, oh. And after uh, Yanni is Tatic. You want to run over to him? Want to yell? Ho 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 ho! <laughs> and I'm about right? to show him the way of the fist. Want to punch him two times? Uh, fourteen to hit on the first one. Uh, yeah, that'll hit. Okay, and the second one will not. Okay, I can tell you already. Uh, eight damage. All right. So you uh, run up to him, kind of run up really quick. You slide and do a punch Don't right, in, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> right into his groin. <laughs> Get him right in the groin, he kind of sits over his blood coming out. <laughs> dead, dead ball My wiener punch. <laughs> and he's dead. 
That's how you do it. Oh, uh, by the way, I am sophisticated. I my arrows. Oh, uh, well, I have for my arrows. The uh, last room, uh, you guys. Uh, you each gain. <laughs> There's no way that's possible. <laughs> <laughs> it's over 9,000! <laughs> what? <laughs> we should search the bodies in this room this time. Yes, yes. Uh, you each gain 50 XP. Oh, cool. I like it when you do uh, numbers that end in zero because yeah. it makes it very, very easy. easy. Uh, and then for this room, uh, 25 XP each. 25. Ah, oh, you ruined it. Son of a bitch. What are you doing? I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't get. To, I don't get to pick what the XP is. <coughs> you literally do. You are literally the person that picks the XP. <laughs> no, I don't. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, it comes on the character. It comes on the. Yeah, monster. but you get to choose what's in the room. <laughs> for XP, not gold. No, but you get to choose what's in the room, and oh, they're yes. them, you would choose how much XP is That's available. That's too much. That may be too much. Alright, so what did I say to give you guys? 15 and 25. 15 and 25? Yeah. Okay. I I so are we sticking with that? So I'm sticking with it. I Can we, uh... Sticking with what? You're over 400 XP. 415. I have 388. I have 384. I see, so you guys have to be above yeah. 300. I got, um, I got the old So the two people are dead, there, uh, right? Superman. And one yeah. of them is the bartender from the. the yep, so tall dude. She's the she's the bartender's wife. The bartender's wife. She, she came up and could try to hit on you, hit on uh, Tadek while he was drunk. And oh, uh, it's uh, yeah. that one. Yeah. Can we search <laughs> her? Yes. I, I yeah. Like see if we can yeah. find mm -hmm. something like. Uh, oh, you going up? Yeah, yeah, you guys can go ahead. We and know this room. We we left it. Actually, I'm going to first. Actually, you said. Her throat was cut. Yep, their throats and were cut, and then everything their, is just their guts are kind of falling. Okay, out. okay. Is I think it's obvious what killed them. <laughs> Probably a sword. I'm going to yes, loot them. I guess. Yeah, See yeah. if they have any keepsakes on their bodies. Okay. Yeah. Go and roll the investigation that check. I could uh, bring back. Can I help them out. Yes. Uh, blue one three three five says I want to play. Lol. Ooh, that's <laughs> James in Indiana. Oh, is it? Yeah. What's up, James? Oh, hello, James, James in Indiana. Indiana. <laughs> James from Indiana. Man, dude, wish you'd be here to play. We're missing one person right now. That'd be perfect. Ooh, yeah, man, uh, dude. You said <laughs> man, 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 investigation. Man, dude. Huh? Investigation? Oh, uh, yeah, investigation roll. Uh, 16. 16. Uh, all right, so um, you check the other one that you're not familiar with. You don't find anything on him at all. Okay, uh, you check Satal. He knows there's kind of a pouch in there. Okay. So take out the pouch and you open it and you see 36 electron pieces. Ooh, it's a lot of money! <laughs> Holy shit, Dalek. It looks like you're buying drinks next time. I don't want to drink ever again. <laughs> Actually, I don't know about that. Tell me that after what I don't hear. That's a good point. It's like 15 gold. I like to look around yeah. the room. But like... Electrum is under gold. <laughs> oh, yes, please. So it's I like my bad. Gold. I was thinking of something else. Platinum? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot. I've never got an Electrum before. I like to look around the room just to see if there's anything. <coughs> uh, yeah, give me a perception. 16, 20, well wait, 16, 18. Um, yes, you're, you're able to look, you're kind of looking around the room. Um, the, the, uh, you can see through the bodies, you can tell that the same things are missing from their bellies, the, the pancreas, the belly, and the heart. Um, everything else in the room just kind of seems like there's nothing uh, of use, nothing of value in there. And then lastly, can we check the guards? guards. Can we check or the cultists? Cultists? Uh, yeah, roll an investigation. 18. Alright. Um, I actually gave you what the cultists had for Sitalda. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, well, you guys didn't check the last one, so, so I don't know if you guys were going to check these ones, so I just gave it to you. So did we, um, are, are their clothes too torn to be, like, could, like, could we take their clothes? Like, You and, could. Like, I mean, they're, they're bloodied, the and the belly part of the shirt is of the cultist. ripped. Oh, the cultists? You can take the cultist robes. Okay. Yeah, I like to take the cultist robes. Yes, in case we need to disguise, yeah, disguise yeah. ourselves. Um, right. They do also do have, uh, the cultists have blood patterns on their face for 
um, just ritual religion reasons. Yeah. Um, so you can try, and <laughs> if you want to disguise, you'll have to try and see if you can recreate. I would like to do these. Yes, I would like yes, to try it too. too. All right, everyone, yeah. give me a performance. Oh, oh that's that really good. I'm super excited. I've never got to use this check before. Oh, nine. <laughs> Seven. Five. <laughs> All right, so you guys well, take this blood, <laughs> and it more looks like you guys just kind of rub blood on your face. No patterns of some sort are even close to what yeah, was on the cultist's face. How do I look? How do I look? He uh, looks exactly like them. Wait, wait. What's, what's his name? Look? What's his name? What's his name? Look awesome. Indiana? Oh, perfect. John from Indiana? James, James. from Indiana. Yeah. Uh, James. not much. Uh, we... Not much. We, I, could play with you online from here. That'd be so difficult. Yeah, well, <laughs> that yes. Is. Uh, Unfortunately, sorry, uh, James, we do have a full group, but, uh, if, you know, if we're missing, if you, you know, could drive down from Indiana, we'd love to have you. Hey, yeah. we've ta I've talked to him about it before. Yeah, drive down. He's the I, I nerd radio guy. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, James, if you wanted, if you ever came down, I could run a one shot with you and uh, Thunderbird. Yeah, we could do it, or he could spell well, it yeah, sometime. Yeah. yeah. If there's anybody ever out? Have yeah, you guys want to do the one shot too? No. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm actually like working, working on one that's really interesting. Oh, cool. All uh, right. So you, anything, you guys, do anything else in the room? You guys, did you guys now have these robes on over so, your armor and everything? Um, but your faces are just, your heads are just completely covered. I like how blood. we've just steamrolled everybody. It looked yeah. like this, I am very, like, like, you guys haven't ran to the harder ones, but I did not realize that it was going to be like this. Well, we've got lucky on this ship. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, yeah. And these guys have gotten good rolls. I've gotten that one. stupid so. damage roll. Me? Yeah. It's a 1d8 plus 2. Yeah. I mean, level two, I guess. Yeah. I think you punch through people. Yeah. Senses. I punch through people. I I slash my. Do a, I slash my. Low shield. damage attacks, but you have to do a lot of them. them. All right, and we're back, guys. Uh, back from our break here, and they just got done killing four cultists in the room. Uh, and you guys are ready to move on to the next room. Uh, so in that uh, bottom right hand corner there is just an archway, no door. Can we peek through it? Uh, you can peek through it, um, you just kind of see, just, it kind of just looks like a, the end of it just looks like it kind of goes off to another room, so it's a corridor. Can I stealthily walk down the corridor and to wherever the entrance is and see if I can see anything? Uh, so it kind of comes off to a corner, do you want to kind of peek around the corner? Yeah. Um, so, yeah, so roll me a stealth check. Uh, 23. Alright, so, uh, you walk up very sneakily, kind of look around the corner, it seems really dark in this room, but you can see uh, light coming from a door uh, if you're looking at it to, uh, to your right. Okay. There's some wall and there's a door. Okay. So I'm going to go back and so down the corridor, there's a dark room, there's a light at the end. I don't know if I'm about to go down there, it looks a little bit yet. I don't know, man. It sounds pretty risky. It's really dark, you can't tell what's in this room. There's yeah. just little light shining from the there. Entire, the entire thing is creepy, yes. so I think, I think we might as well go in. Yes. You guys want to go in? Uh, none of you have dark vision, you won't be able to see. Oh, if I am fully aware of it. Um, <laughs> I will let I'd like to faith guide me. Wait, should wait, I, guys, I got an idea. Should we light the torch? Should I? Yeah, I got an idea. I'd like to take um, some of the clothes and the bone from one of the bodies. I'd like to light it on fire and use it as a torch. You know we just have torches, right? <laughs> or we could just use a torch. <laughs> that's, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> Whatever works. Uh, do you guys have torches? I do. Alright, oh, you just go ahead and light it, you guys are walking in this room. Well, somebody else should hold the torch because it's... I will hold the torch. Yeah. I have a <laughs> range. So I, I will punch someone with the torch. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Alright, so you guys walk into this room. Uh, it was completely dark. Now you've kind of lighting up the room so that you can see. Um, the light from escaping from the archway was to the northeast. Uh, room seems completely empty. The uh, smell of cooking meat fills the room. Mm. Does it smell good? Um, I mean, yeah, it just smells like it just smells like someone's cooking meat somewhere. Uh, you can kind of hear chattering coming from the uh, the archway. Yes, I am so hungry. Do you smell that? Yes, but it's probably not what you think it is. <laughs> but it smells so good. No. I don't know if you <laughs> would want to eat what it is. Why not? What, what has been missing from everybody that we've come across? I mean, it's just so in... Oh, what? <laughs> what? It smells yes. pretty good. But it's just so in in enchanting. Just... You no, know, but when we get to the food, you can try some. <coughs> okay, fair deal. Yes. Mm. 
All right, so you guys are gonna go through the archway? Yes. Uh, is there a light on the other side? Um, so... Can we see light on the other side of it? So you guys look, so you, you try to look through the, the archway before you actually walk in. Yeah. Uh, just a, just a, uh, a hallway. Down the it's a hallway? Just like, a hallway, just a corridor. Is this the hallway that, like, from the room that we were in? No, it's the Or is it no, it's from the dark room? From the dark okay. room. Okay, okay. Can I stealth up and see what I see? Uh, do you just see a door on the other end? Mm. Oh, and the door you, is, yeah. You, you should check the door to see yeah. if it's locked. Yeah, is the door locked? Uh, no, door just seeing you kind of give a kind of just a slight pull and it kind of opens up a little bit. The ch chattering gets louder. You slowly close it. It's not locked. You should peek through the door. See what you see open yes. it a little. Yeah, what's through the door? All right, so you peek open just a little bit. Give me a stealth check. Um, fourteen. All right. Um. Yep. So you're able to just kind of peek into the door. And uh, this here, get to the spot real quick. Um, as you open the door a little bit, the smell of food is now really getting strong. It smells really good. Uh, the room is lined with counters, ovens, and a refrigerator. The, uh, there's a dining room <laughs> table in the middle of the room. Seven cultists are just enjoying a nice meal and chattering about and talking. So there's a lot of guys in there. Um... Well, there's a table. Seven. Yeah, how far away is the table from the door? I don't know. Check my drawing on that. Um, it's, it's a pretty, it's a pretty small room. It's probably, it's not too far. I mean, you're probably talking one, two, three, four, five, twenty feet away. Is anyone so. looking at the door? No, no, they're all just enjoying, he, he, they don't notice him at all. Okay. Uh, cracking this door open and they're all just uh, having a feast. Well, what we should do is put the torch out and ignite the torch out mm -hmm. and then rush in. Look, mm -hmm. and, I'll, and I'm gonna scream. I'm oh, gonna oh, scream me, something. I'm gonna start drawing this yeah. up while you guys are saying. Yeah. What you guys so are he flips yeah. the table and I scream, "Run for your lives, <laughs> man!" And I'm just gonna make sure that arrow is someone. I mean, whoever's out there, I'll just shoot them. <laughs> we have to draw the room first. Okay, <laughs> so. <laughs> Short range. <laughs> well, no, we're I can, running I can into the room. One. We're running into the room covered with blood all over our faces. And somebody <laughs> flips over a table like, run for your lives! <laughs> what, if, what if they think it's a cult, another cultist? And they're like, oh shit, we gotta run. Is that what you guys are doing? Because you might as well just roll for initiative right now. Well, I'm, I'm, uh, well, I'm intimidating. We we're we... intimidating, I'd say. I'm intimidating. Or we could try, try to intimidate Because I'm coming in and looking like a blood. deceive them. Making them think that we're cultists that are you, okay. You'll have uh, bloody. You can do that. You'll just have a uh, oh, disadvantage. Disadvantage because you guys didn't get the uh, performance. Performance, correct. So let's do because my intimidation's plus two. Yeah, but that if you're intimidating them, then you might as well just attack them on a surprise round. Wait, because if yeah. they run, then yeah, they yeah, run. yeah. You don't think they'll run? If they run, well, if they run, well, then they won't have a chance to run. Yeah. Maybe but you fun. shot an arrow. No? Yeah, no, okay. So we'll just, yet. we'll attack. Well, do we want to attack or do we want to try and make them think we're cultists? Let's, let's make them think we're cultists. Okay, we're going to make them think we're cultists. Um, uh, move the map just one way or the other. No, 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 side, like side to side. Uh, that way. That way. That way. That way. Good. Oh, oh. So we should all, we should all run into the room and then slam the door behind us and then we have to try and convince them that there's something, the people that are there. <laughs> Somebody's like, guys, you don't know what's going on back there. This is really bad. Or actually, but there's so many guys in there. Maybe we should surprise them and get an upper hand on that battle. Well, we did just bust in. Maybe we might we as well. We haven't busted in yet. Okay, all right. So that's just what we're planning on doing. Why don't Why don't we try and sneak? Because where's the Where's the entrance? <laughs> we have to do pretty good stealth rolls. To well, get in. we could try and sneak under the table. And then where's the Where's the okay, <laughs> Sneak no. under the table. Yeah. <laughs> we have to roll very high for that. Well, who knows? Maybe we can. 
comes off into here. You guys are on the right hand side. So mm -hmm. are we trying to deceive them? I think deceive them. That what do you think it'll work like you think it will? Yeah, but well, oh, we're at a disadvantage. Try. Yeah. Well, when they're not, we're not. We're at the advantage right now. We have to jump on them. There's seven of them. If we can at least. So you guys are not in the room yet, correct? Correct. Okay. So yeah, just kind of tell me what you guys are gonna do. Whenever you're ready. Um, discuss. I think that we we should attack first. There's there's a lot of them in there. Why don't you stealth attack one? Well, it should be a surprise attack. Yeah. Surprise attack, yeah. Fuck it. Let's just run in. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Run in and just attack. Just, just hit them. So yeah. then we can do more damage mm -hmm. on the front end. Yeah. Right. Us. And. <coughs> I'm very fast, so I'm going to go for this. All right. Yeah. So we're just going to charge right in. All right. Just uh, gun, gun, guns blazing. Does the door open inward? Uh, no, it opens back like this. Damn. <laughs> God. Okay. Well, you can just oh. swing the door open. Yeah. 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 You I'll open break the, door. the door open for dramatic. Might as well. You can try. No, because that might end up. It swinging. might end up if you don't it, do it. Yeah. I'll open right the here. door so that you can run in. And then, and then you run in next, and then I'll come in after you guys. Sure. Okay. All right, everyone, roll for initiative. <laughs> that's not good. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's oh. all right. <laughs> oh, that's not. That's definitely <laughs> that's not good. Not good. It's not bad. It's not great. <laughs> that is. It literally could not yeah, get any worse. Get any worse. Yeah. <laughs> well, you didn't lower initiative. Uh, attack. Five. Pelius <laughs> got a twelve. Or 14, sorry. Okay, that is initiative. Reinhardt? 16. Got it. Yardy. 17. <laughs> Yardy. Yeah, all right. Who do you think All I right, am? so you guys run in. Unfortunately, they all turn around. And they get to go first. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Nothing like rolling a nat 20, baby. Oh, I'm the first one in. I am about to get five. All right. Is that not a surprise attack? Oh. Uh, again? You were the only one that you, you you just ran in. You didn't try and sneakily. There was no sneak. Oh, you just okay. you just char you all charge in. Ah! You know, look and they're all ready to fight. They'll drop their food and they're ready to go. Oh, okay. your butt looks good on camera. Thank you. I like I like how you Should took the time. You want a butt <laughs> look, look. <laughs> <laughs> He's just sitting there explaining what's going on. <laughs> oh boy, I would not be. Well, where's Peely's at? Is, that on the board? is he dead? You're in here? Oh, okay. I'm on the board. Yeah, I would be right there. Actually. Yep. Yeah, because you went Because I'm the last one. I oh, that's not good. <laughs> All right, uh, three will be able to attack this turn, and the one on the right is going to attack. Which one are you? Yep, I'm going to attack you. Oh, damn. Uh, the, the two of them are going to attack. Okay. Cool. Have you guys ever thought maybe we should try talking to these guys? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's out of the question at this point. <laughs> That's pretty out. We're on a killing rampage. <laughs> Alright, uh, that'll be plus three, so 16 to hit's the highest. Does not hit. Wow, they both miss. So they both, they they're run up to you, they take their uh, skimitars out, and they miss. The other one comes out. I use my blinding speed. Yep. <laughs> almost, sh almost shimmer. You're kind of shimmering. Yeah. Kind of looks like you're over here, but actually you're over here. And then you move over here, and it looks like you're still there. And he attacks that one and misses. Nice. Ooh. All right, and the last one will attack. Is that you up there? Yeah. Thirteen. Misses. Man, I'm gonna start rolling higher for these guys. Mm -hmm. All right, so he comes up and goes to attack you. Are you gonna dodge it? Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna, just gonna <laughs> switch yeah. to the side. Just yeah. switch. Misses. And now that is the end of their turn. Coming up next is Yachty. Um, so I'm going to attack the one that just attacked me with my short sword. Um, it's going to be a 15 to hit. All right, roll for attack. Or for damage. Three points of damage. Give was your dagger. It was a short sword. Short sword? Yeah. Uh, how many points? Three. Two. Uh, the guy that's, that attacked me. That's the right for me. OK. So he attacks me, and I'm just gonna immediately pull out my sword and just cut down. Yeah, that was two damage. Three. Three. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's a whopping three. Okay. It literally cannot so get much. any lower. <laughs> All right, stick with your sword. You go to slice him. Kind of backs up a little bit. Kind of cuts him around the chest. Mm -hmm. 
Alright, and after that is Reinhardt's turn. Um, I'm gonna go up, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna Rampage. Rage. Attack, right? Rage. Rage. Alright, you, you kinda get pumped up. <laughs> kinda go Rage mode. Yes. And now I gotta look up with it. <laughs> uh, rage is you get um, advantage on all attacks using your strength, okay. and you gain plus two to damage. Okay. And then so I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna run behind that guy, the one that just attacked you. Uh, it is it is half speed or it's uh, terrain. So it's oh, yes. for each one foot yeah. is actually uh, allies. You five. get past with normal. Is it allies normal? Okay. So yeah, you, allies you can get past normally. And which ones were not ready? Any one that was not these three, right? What do you to mean? attack that turn? They didn't have weapons drawn or what? No, they did they, not. In, they couldn't. They weren't in range. Oh, okay. Well, if you want to move behind, technically you would take opportunity. Um, oh, oh, is this side? Yep. Yeah, let's you're just that. attack the guys yeah. right next to you. Yeah, that that works. <laughs> yeah. Um. Thirteen. Uh, to hit, hit. That hit. is. Oh, you have advantage. Yeah. yeah. So you get a roll again. Oh, okay. You hit anyways. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so it's 15. Alright, roll for damage. 7. Alright. Um, 8. Yeah. 8 damage. Uh, I'll just do this one. Play it. It's 1. Just my sword. Strength. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so you run up. Run up to attack him. Go to cut him. Okay. You kind of uh, give a deep gash and right across the side of his uh, torso. He's bleeding heavily. He's, he's, he's lo he looks really bad. All right. After uh, Reinhardt's turn is Pelias, and Pelias is going to kind of boxed in back yeah, there. Kind of screwed. All right. So uh, move him to the right, and then go in between the two to the to, to the right, ah. and in between, right there. He's going to attack the one to the. He's going to attack the one that you've already attacked. That'll make it way easier on me. Okay. And misses. All right. I'm she pretty sure. Um, yep. Yeah, yeah. All right. After Julius' uh, turn, Todd. Going to go ahead. Uh, this guy, the one that tried to attack me, I'm gonna punch him twice. All right. The old punch punch. Uh, twenty-one, and. 14. Yup, that's gonna hit. Roll for damage. Which one did you hit, by the way? Uh, the two that attacked me. So the two in front of me. So you're gonna hit one each, or? Or, I guess the one right in front of me. Okay. Which two? The one that's already damaged. Yeah. Uh, that would be... 14 damage. Alright. So you, you're right there, he kinda, did he hit you, right? No, he missed. No. So you kind of you're angry that he hit you. You got a one you uh, into, you run into his face <laughs> and you punch into his stomach. Your your hand going completely through his stomach, <laughs> and then you pull out. And you have a, you have a small intestine in your hands. You throw it to the ground. He <laughs> falls over. Yes. Wow. Wow. You know, for a monk, I am very <laughs> very brutal. Oh, like, what they teach you about a <laughs> Knock it in and knock it out. He, he ain't living with a small intestine. <laughs> All right. After that is the uh, cultist's turn. They're gonna close in on their prey. Oh, they're all gonna get to attack this turn. Good thing you guys have heal pots. Heal pots. One of you. Healing <laughs> potions. Heal pots. Plus, guys, I have a healer skin, so it's all. All right. First one. First two on the right are going to attack you. Uh, right here. Uh, 14 is the highest? No. Alright, next two, next, the next two next to him are attacking, uh, Pedius. Both miss. God damn. Next two on the left are attacking... You for killing their cultist friend. He was the cook, so they're pretty pissed off that you killed their cook. Oh, Makes cool. great food. 17. Uh, that does, yeah, it's a tie, but... Oh, yeah, yeah, it goes. Yeah, it hits. Uh, so the one on the the middle one is going to uh, attack you, and he is going to do seven damage. Oh! Takes out wow. a scimitar, straight up slashes you right across the chest. 
bad. That hurts really bad. What do you have for I did health wise? Uh, 16 total. Oh, okay, yeah, you're still fine. Yeah, you're good. Nine health. <laughs> All right, and after their turn is Yachty. You again? Okay. Um, Man, I keep switching, forgetting to switch to the battle music. I'm going to talk a better man. Use my attack with my. Well, actually, yeah, I'm gonna attack with my short sword again. The guy right in front of me. Okay. That's a 24 to hit. Uh, it misses. No, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> you for my 1d6. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, and that does seven points of damage. The one right in front of you? Yep. Alright, so you take out your short sword, you jab it into his stomach, mm -hmm. you pull it out, and he's, he's still standing. Still? Whoa. Oh. Man, this guy's resilient. That, that, that wasn't the one you attacked right? before, was yeah, it? it was. Oh, never mind, he's yeah. dead. Oh, yeah, I was yeah. like, yeah. Wow. I was gonna say, wow, that guy took a slash in the chest and he's got a hole in his stomach. Yeah, so you stab in the stomach, you pull yeah. it out, uh, you pull, you kind of pull to the side. Like so through the spine and then... Yep, and then you cut it so yeah. it's like kind of half open. Yeah, it's we're all about cutting it. Just <laughs> <laughs> out of sight, he that's, falls that's over. That's a go-to. He's dead. Perfect. He's dead. That's my turn. All right, Yadi, you Reinhardt's turn. All right, um, I'm gonna attack the guy that's right in front of me. All right. Alright, that's oh, funny. Ooh. So roll another one of those. One of these? Yeah. Uh, no, you roll double damage. Oh, what? No, that's six stuff. So six. So six. six and, then. and eight. Uh, s seven and nine. Six. Because I have plus one. So what's the total damage? You only get 16. one plus 16. one. No, 15. 15. 15. 15. Oh, oh, you only get 15 one plus, plus one. two because you're raging. That's oh. 17. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, so you take out your sword and you just straight <laughs> cut off his head. His head just falls up and then falls yeah, down. It falls out. And, his, <laughs> and his, his eyes are still darting to the side, and then just kind of the light kind of fades from his eyes and he's dead. Yes. His body Ooh. falls over. Which one was that? It was, it was kind of scary. <laughs> All right, after Reinhardt is Peleus. He's going to attack the one that's uh, right next to him, the one that, next to the one that just died. He's going to hit. And that's, whoo, two sixes. Nice, that is gonna kill him. Wow. They're just rolling through this. We just yeah. run into the rooms and massacre people. People are afraid of, the gods are afraid of us at this point. <laughs> we're gonna take this like confidence into the boss battle. Yeah, and all 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 he's just kinda tired of doing the whole uppercut slash, so he just goes straight from the side, cutting him in half. The body kinda, the body doesn't seem to move at all. And then slowly just fall, each side just falls to the ground, just blood spewing everywhere. Helios <laughs> is all about cut. Helios <laughs> just cuts people on half, dude. I'll have to let Mike know that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right, and after Helios is static with his five. <laughs> hey, uh, I'm gonna punch the one right in front of me. All right, twice. Uh, <laughs> uh, lowest is 19 to hit. Oh uh, yeah, both of those are gonna hit. Uh. Thirteen. All right. You did two punches. Yes, I did. All right. So you just you get up and your our hands start to kind of give like a key glow to them. You just quick and his, his chest completely just encaves and <laughs> as he coughs up blood and just falls down dead. Why in the world? I, uh, <laughs> I guess I do not know my own strength. And he's down for the count. Should be two left, yep, and now it's their turn. Uh, they're both going to attack uh, Peleus. Uh, woo! Critical! Oh, oh, no. The other one didn't hit. That's not good. <laughs> it's two in one fight. Seven, eight damage. Which is fine. Amount. Yeah. This has 30 health. <laughs> what? Oh, whoa. Wow. All right, so the uh, the cultist takes his short sword and kind of jabs it into uh, Peleus with his. What armor does he have? None. 
the barbarian. Shit, work well, I was thinking of. <laughs> All right, so he takes his he takes his short sword and kind of cuts at his thigh and gives him a deep gash into his uh, into his left thigh. All right, after uh, their turn is back to the top, Yachty. All right, so I'm gonna walk. Can you make me walk around to the next guy? And we've done no damage. To him. <coughs> no, none of these guys have damage. Okay, walk all the way up to him. I'm gonna attack him with my short sword. Okay. That's a eight to hit. No, it doesn't hit like that. That's all I can do then. All right, after Yachty is Reinhardt. Okay, um, I'm gonna go over right here and attack this guy. All right. Okay. Yeah, eight. Nope. Um, seventeen. Why'd you hit twice? Because I'm raging. You don't get attacked right, twice advantage. if you're raging. Advantage. Yeah, I get it. Oh, advantage. yeah, yeah, advantage, yeah. yeah. So what was the... Se uh, seventeen. Uh, that'll hit. Okay, seven. Uh, eight. Eight damage? Plus another two. Eight. Oh, nine, ten. 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 All right. So you take your, uh, you take your short sword. You kind of do an uppercut attack, cutting him in half again. What? Completely just goes completely just the same way. Just yes. Falls over. The floor is now literally. All sideways. Huh? All sideways. Yeah. yeah. Falls yeah. Just falls nope. Down. One falls one way. The other one falls the other. That's see that's Front new. Yeah. That's, what? Real. that's new. Twist. Whoa. Twist. All right. After uh, now it's uh, that extent. Oh, that knocked that one over. Like, nope, other one. Oh, other one. Chris, what are you doing? Like I said, I'm no, sorry. <laughs> the god's hand comes down, <laughs> uses his hand, crushes the cultist. I'm going to hit that one with two punches. Actually, good to mix it up this time. A punch and a kick. Whoa! Oh. They are both going to hit. Alright, roll for damage. <coughs> Nine. Alright. Just what you needed. <laughs> All right, so you take your punch and you uh, punch him to the side of the head, kind of. He's kind of not unconscious, but he's just kind of dizzy. And then you you give him a good old kick and you kick him all the way across the room, smashing into the wall, and just falls over. And when he hits the wall, just. <laughs> <laughs> what? There's the lots world. of blood in here. <laughs> everyone blood. Everyone bleeds when they die. Really into the Everybody. Whole You're into the, the spray. Did you watch the anime? Do it with punches. Watch it too many Dragon Ball Z. Yeah. <laughs> and he's all the way to the other side of the wall. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's he's messed up. He's like, way dead. Very very strong. Um, all right, that's the end of battle. You guys all get. What room are we in? Uh, you guys get. Oh my god, we can't be here for this one. Uh, 58 XP. 58? <laughs> I'm to the point where I need to use a calculator for this. You're welcome. Anytime. <clears throat> Anytime that I can help. Oh, I guess I... Okay, so the meat in the room, do we see it? Oh, yeah, no, yep, so uh, give me a perception. Yeah, the food. Yeah, I'll use that. Uh, over 19. Over 19, yep, so you're, you're, able to tell that, you're able to tell that the smell is coming. The, the food on the table is pretty well eaten. Uh, everything's been bitten on and stuff like that. Uh, there's not very much left. They're kind of close to the end of their meal, but you can hear like seconds? I can hear Come that. You, sorry, you can smell it. <laughs> what? You can smell it. It smells like they're cooking seconds in the oven. I would like okay. to go see if we can find the seconds. Well, I mean, it comes from the yeah. oven. So, <laughs> in the oven. Everyone's just hinting it's in the oven. It's in the oven. I'm hearing it smells, so I don't know. I'm hearing smells. It's an interesting game. At this point, I don't even know what's real anymore. I would like to go take the food out of the oven. All right, yeah, you don't need to mess with it. And I'm just, just I'm gonna eat oh, some of it. Just take the oven. Uh, you find you five. Yeah, out of a burning you oven. Find five days worth of worth of rations. Sweet. Oh. And it's a regular food. Yeah, just rations. You got just regular. Oh, food. see guys. What? Follow your well, stomach, man. I thought for sure that would be hearts and pancreas. No, just, no they're eating. No, they're they're not that satanic. They're, they're close. They're, 
It's in the scene. It's like cold demonic. Demonic. Person that no, they're scrolling demonic symbols all over the walls. Uh, sorry, why, why was there anything else in this room or anything on their person? Uh, give me a uh, perception check. Uh, okay. Uh, Twenty-one. 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 Twenty
Torture tools sit at the table near the bodies. Coming into the chamber from the door on the east side are two harpies. As they, um, they don't see you, so I can't read this. <laughs> I say nothing. Uh, shit, shit. Uh, what do you see? There's, there's, there's people that don't see so you. So you actually come, you come back and you close the door to tell them. Can I open the door stealthily again, though? Yeah, yeah, you're, 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 your stealth check will be the same. Okay, guys, okay so. These, <laughs> but if they come in with you, they're going to have to roll stealth okay. as well. There is two harpies in there, and there's two people without any skin, but they're alive. <laughs> they're screaming like crazy. What do you mean they're alive? They're alive. James oh, you home. can hear. They can hear the screams. No skin. They Those can screams hear the screams. Are people without skin? No way. Yes, there's there's, 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 there's no way this is going on. What? Do you think I'm shitting you? <laughs> <laughs> it's really happening. It's crazy. Well, you know, I but think... but but there's two harpies in there. We need to. We can't save these people without killing the harpies. I can so get in there very easily, but you guys are a little bit loud, so if you come in, be quiet. Okay. Because All right. we should try to surprise the harpies. I'll come in with you. I'll come in first. Then I will go in Well, first. I mean after you. I'll go in first after you. I'm going to also follow behind all of you. Okay. Okay. So we're all gonna... We're all sneaking in. Good, I thought you were going to chance one. Right? But you're all going to stealth? Yes. Alright, you two roll stealth checks one. <laughs> that's not a d20. <laughs> oh god, 10. That's not a d20. Huh? That's not a d20. Oh. Oh, that god. I got. Hey! That there I got. We go. There we go. Uh, nice. 18. Butt for the cam here. Butt cam. Butt cam. I rolled a 10. I'm so sorry. You rolled a 10? Yes. What the hell, man? Get out of you're not a part of the group anymore. You gotta stay behind. It's not bad. And these guys here are chained to the wall. I'm in the front of the group. So what are we just gonna stealth walk up to them? No, I'm gonna shoot them. I'm I, I'm not though. I'm only me. Right, so what did you roll? Me? Yeah, a ten. Ah, uh, you sneak. <gasps> Yes! You are all, uh, what'd you roll? 18. All of you are undetected. Whoa. The Harpies uh, looking at, or just kind of looking at the uh, people chained on the wall, just, hey! <laughs> <laughs> we get fucking Harpies. Should we try and distract them and let the people know? No, we should. Oh, yeah, they have no skin. Yeah. I was going to say, maybe they can help us. They cannot help us. <laughs> that will not help um, us. I think you guys are kind of having, you know, like the worst day of your life, but uh, could you guys help us kind of <laughs> get like, through? Ah, ah. <laughs> Just touching the floor with your feet. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Yeah. We don't have any, like, it's kind of potions for us. Yeah. <laughs> well, sorry, you guys, we need these. Uh, so, yeah. So, can I get a stealth attack in for them on the harpies? Oh, yeah, you could, yeah, you can sneak up, uh, yeah, if you want to do a stealth attack. Yeah, I'm uh, attack If you guys want to, so, uh, if you guys run for stealth and you get, so they're going to be surprised, um, you all get to go a whole round before they get to attack. Yes. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. We're pretty notorious for cutting things in half. <laughs> all right, just decide amongst yourself who wants to go first and kind of um, give a whole turn. Yeah, we'll let you go first. Speed doesn't come into account. It doesn't, at this yeah. Point. At, at this point, it does. Oh, it does. 15 like to hit. I make it. Uh, I think we all can. Huh? 15 to hit. Um, that'll hit. Yes. Yeah. And whopping three damage. Woo! Nice. Oh, you Since are it's on fire. Surprise round. Isn't it instant critical though? Nah, I don't know. No, 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 no. It's, not. Oh, that's, it's only I'm, if you're a rogue. I'm used to playing a rogue. I'm like, dude, that would be ridiculous. You guys <laughs> will never be able to surprise anybody. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> to Gresland. All right, so you take your quiver very sneakily, kind of bent over. You kind of pull it back, and you <laughs> release, <laughs> and it kind of catches the harpy right in the back. It's <laughs> very angry at you now. I wonder why. <laughs> as oh, as no. the arrow lands, Tannic would like to... Oh, uh, which one did you attack, by the way? The one close to him. Okay... As the, uh, right. as the arrow damage, hits yeah, the harpy, yep. I'm going to kick the wing. Alright, go ahead and give attack. And then punch it as well. <laughs> In right. the face after the kick. <laughs> uh, 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 14. <coughs> 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 That's not going to hit. 
All right, so uh, your first one was the uh, kick? Yes. Six. <laughs> All right. So you kick the wing, so you kick the wing, it kind of gives a, kind of moves it forward and slaps it in the face a little bit. <laughs> it was focused on you, not to, <laughs> looks at you and ready to attack. Your turn. Um, I'm going to attack the one that you guys haven't attacked yet. Man, don't make it difficult for me or anything. Perfect. Just to me. Um, oh, 12. Uh, that's going to hit. For 8. Damage. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you run up to it and you kind of swing up and you cut its wing off and it's still able to flap with one wing. It's now having to try very much harder, but it's it still can pick itself up. <laughs> and it's kind of. It's, <laughs> and blood just <laughs> comes out the side because there's got to be blood everywhere. There's blood everywhere. There's already All right, blood and everywhere. everyone roll for initiative. Uh, oh my god! god. <laughs> what is up with this guy? Not ones all night. You're playing like I play. Uh, I was about it. Five. Five. Again. Right. Uh, twelve. Yeah, eight, nine. Man. Up first is Reinhardt. All right, so I'm gonna finish off the guy <coughs> I started attacking. Around. All right. <laughs> or maybe not. No, you're uh, not. six. Nah, it's not gonna Nah, hit. it's not gonna hit, okay. Alright, after Reinhardt is Yachty. Oh yeah, I'm gonna shoot another arrow at the one that he attacked. Okay. Uh, 23 to hit. Nope. You know? Nope. <laughs> uh, uh, 4 points of damage. 4 oh, on yeah. hit? Yeah. Alright. So you take your bow, take the quiver out, go back to shoot again, and you, and you do another wink, and then shoot it, and it... <laughs> Who, who am I winking at? Yeah. <laughs> am I winking at the heartbeat? Oh, okay, yeah. I was like just winking at me or oh, something. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, just, I'm just so beautiful, they're just all just like, you know, <laughs> shimmering and winking. Yeah. It kind of looks at you and right between the eyes, kind of gives a couple wings and kind of floats up a little bit and then falls over. With one wing. And, <laughs> oh yeah, it's the one wing. Yeah. So it's, <laughs> it's and it falls just over and its body head. just kind of... Dissipates and crumbles into a pile of ash. That shit? Did you see that? I think it's Thanos. So I mean, it's Thanos. No. <laughs> I don't know what. You, you throwing out spoilers over here? <laughs> I haven't spoiler. seen the movie. Is that I haven't seen the movie. Throwing out spoilers like that? No spoilers. And that's my turn. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Okay. So I'm still kind of. I'm just. It's that's not, not a spoiler. Not okay. A spoiler. Uh, yeah, so who just went? That was your turn. All right. So now it's yeah. the harpy's turn. It's actually going to. Use Luring Song. Uh, the harpy sings a magic melody. Every humanoid and giant within 300 feet of the harpy can hear the song and must succeed on a DC 11 wisdom saving throw or be charmed until the song ends. Alright. Well, I passed that. Is that 18? 7. So I'm 7 plus your wisdom saving throw. Uh. Oh, uh, it's up. It's all the way up to the top. <laughs> Right? Mm -hmm. Yep. So seven. Seven. Okay. Yeah. Twenty. All right. So you are now uh, charmed, uh, which means that uh, do I love it now? A target is incapacitated and ignores the songs of the other harpies. Um, I only have ears for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And what is this beautiful creature? Have your about five feet away. All right. Let me read this really quick. Okay, you have, to, you have to repeat the saving throw at the end of each of your turns. Uh, but yet you were incapacitated. You were just kind of looking at it, just kind of by its music. You're just, <laughs> just dancing along. All it's right, nice the best. and um, it that was its uh, that was its turn, and now it's back up to was Reinhardt. He's sitting there dancing, and now it is. Wait, does he no, sorry, Todd. It's he your turn. Make another saving throw at the end of his yeah, turn. But it's it's Todd. It's, it's Todd's okay. turn too. When they go, he goes because he rolls really well. Punch yeah. two times. Don't worry. All right. Critical. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah. You can roll for damage if you want to. And then the next one's fifteen. <laughs> so. You can roll for damage if you want to. Uh. So. Nine. Fifteen. 
All right. So you get into a stance. <laughs> you, you pull your art, your hand back, and it is just bright, glowing with Kai as you key. <laughs> key. I call it Kai, whatever it is. Key. You run it back, and it starts just glowing with key as you <gasps> punch, and its head just. Completely obliterates. Whoa! A Dolgan! <laughs> and it keeps it keeps uh, flapping over towards uh, over towards Yari and. Now am I still dancing while this is and, and when it falls, it <laughs> dissipates back into dust. It is dust though on the ground. It's just a pile of dust now. I like to just lean down and draw a little smiley face in the dust. <laughs> Give me a performance. Actually, with a little winky eye on there. Am I, am I still dancing though? Wink? Uh, performance is fourteen. Fourteen. Yeah. Yeah. You're able to just you draw. You. Oh, it looks really. It actually looks really good. It looks like a human face giving a smile. Yeah. Well, a little, little wink too. With a little wink. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. And what, uh, what are you guys gonna do now? Let's see the combat. Um. So are the people still screaming? screaming? Uh. Yes. <laughs> I was dancing through that. Yeah. Uh, James says you did a falcon punch. <laughs> <laughs> so much pain they don't even know what's going on in the room they're still just screaming in pain you know, they are kept alive only by magic you know what can i give one of them i, I want to give one of them a, a healing potion don't do that yeah, maybe the what, what about a healer's kit i want to try and i want to try have no skin they have regenerate some skin how <laughs> magic they're not lizards they don't, so don't regrow what about yeah, kind of comes okay, the consciousness a little bit and just Put us out of our uh, misery. Uh. I'm going to punch that one in the face. <laughs> All right, roll for attack. Well, roll I'm, for going attack. To, I'm going to miss all of my Oh my god! That toy. Oh, that toy. Oh, that toy. Oh, yes, don't even roll for damage. So you you do it again. You concentrate very hard. Go back in your stance. It goes blue again. And just because James said he do a falcon punch, and you, the whole body just. <laughs> And the oh, other body Lord, now comes into blood. consciousness, looks at you and goes, Please, do it again to me! Yeah, please! <laughs> what in the world? I might as well try my luck! <laughs> if this is another 20, I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> Roll for attack? Oh. <laughs> 17. Alright, so you hit. Uh, you should do one punch, you can try for... Uh, we'll go for a second. Alright. Uh, 12. Alright, roll, da roll uh, damage. You hit, both hit. Uh, 15. All right, yep, so you're able to, um, so you just punch it, and it hits it, ah! <laughs> and then you punch it again, just, <laughs> nose goes back into its head and falls limp. Mm. Oh, it was horrifying. And Thank God over. that annoying screaming is over. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> I, I I'm, 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 I'm glad you're calling the people that were in Ride the Pain an annoyance. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear about that was over? <laughs> Right. But did they have anything on them? <laughs> no, they were completely dead. Yeah, they were hiding <laughs> literally in the other room. That was good. Um, so you guys just got done killing a couple harpies that uh, kind of uh, exploded into dust. And what are you guys in here? Uh, what are the two doors there? Uh, yep. Doors or hallways? Uh, they're hallways. One of them, the one at the uh, top there is the is an archway, and the one at the bottom is a door. Check the door. Or a door. Check the door. Check the door. Okay. All right. All right. Um, so you guys want to go ahead and uh, the, the door is unlocked. It's unlocked. It's unlocked. It's unlocked. It's unlocked. Right door. There. Yep. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident. All right. So you guys uh, open the door. Oh, I guess I deleted that. All right, so you guys uh, open, it was a trap door, and now it's not. So you guys just easily open the door, and you guys are, uh, leads into another hall, another corridor. Okay. Straight on. It's a pretty, it's just, uh, about uh, 15 feet, and that turns to the left. Okay, let's go through. Yeah. Yep. All right, okay. so you guys walk through the corridor. Um, well, you got nothing, because that was the screen, so you guys took care of those. All right, so you guys, and there's a door to, uh, you guys are walking on the corridor, you guys walk about 50 feet, and to your right is a door. A ceiling door? Uh, it, the, the corridor keeps going. Let's check the door. Yeah, yeah check the door, yeah, yeah. All right, door is... Uh, yeah, 
Door's not. Door's unlocked. I lied, this door is locked. I would like to try to pick the lock. <laughs> Alright, give me a slide of hand check. Uh, where the hell? Uh, 19. Uh, Alright, so you're able to unlock the door. As you open it, uh, you see that this is the door that, um, uh, the, that has the rotted body parts in it that you guys searched earlier. You guys have already been in this room. Which door so was the car, it? The was that this, the, is, this the, is the, the room with the doors? fresh blood, and, uh, and written in it is uh, all hail Hades. Like the two doors, or is this uh, like the, the single one? This is the single one. The, door, the two doors are to the right now. Should we check the, uh, the last yeah. door in this room, and that just try this area? All right. You guys go and check the last door. Uh, it's an unlocked door. You guys are able just to walk through it. Yeah, might as well. We need to do another corridor. Oh, Let's go right. down it. All right, so you guys, you guys walk down that corridor. I should be able to use this one. Yes, I will. As you guys walk down the corridor, uh, the, you should hear a big <laughs> thunder just rumbles on the outside. The storm is now brewing very heavily, and uh, multiple lightning shaking the shaking the uh, underground temple. And you guys can start to hear the roof rumble and start to break, collapsing. And everyone, give me a, a Dex DC. Oh, I'm gonna these. Save your check, my bad. <laughs> 16. 7. 10. Alright. Um, <laughs> I rolled a 4. <laughs> Who rolled below 11? You two? Alright, you guys each take 1d8 of damage, which I'll roll. Uh, what happened, like, the case oh, for the d10s? Huh? The, like, ceiling collapse? Oh, you guys just roll uh, d8s. <coughs> yep, the roof has collapsed. Oh! 7. You might want to use that potion. Yeah, How much does that restore? You each have you each have one, or no, it was two health potions, right? Yeah. Two, so. so we each have one. It's a uh, one d eight, right? Yep, one d eight damage. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna use it. <coughs> I'm going through all. All right, it's, go the heal. I'm sorry, the healing potion is two d four plus two. Oh. D four is your triangle pyramid. Yep. Oh, my triangle. Six. <laughs> Seven, eight, nine. Um. Okay. And uh, so the so the uh, as the roof crumbles and falls, you're able to back out from you're able to back out into the room, uh, and the floor crumbles. The uh, rocks are each just hitting you, pummeling you two to the ground. You guys are prone now with rocks on top of you. Uh, give me a, uh, an athletic check, see if you guys can un uh, uncover yourself from the rubble. Eight. Uh, Twelve. DC was five. So you guys are oh. able to find, You guys are able to get the rubble off of you and get up. Uh, and you guys are able to carry on through this corridor. Uh, the roof now is uh, completely uh, uh, collapsed, and you guys can see the, the dark sky looming above. You know, honestly, guys, I thought we were much further down. <laughs> so did I. <laughs> <laughs> this is very confusing. Well, you guys are only like a ladder's distance yeah. below Neverwinter. I thought the ladder was long. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's not that. It's yeah. not. The yeah. ceilings are. The ceiling is about um, about twenty. So we're right underneath low. street level. Yeah, yeah. So and you guys right. aren't very like yeah. sewers almost. Yeah, kind of like sewer. You guys are about sewer level from uh, below Neverwinter. Okay. So we should probably be careful now. It seems like the storm is getting worse this direction. So maybe we should start checking for traps as well. Mm -hmm. And, are you guys oh. gonna continue down this corridor or go back to the? Keep going, yeah. Yeah. All right. So you guys uh, uh, start heading uh, north, and then it, uh, the corridor uh, breaks off to the right. Uh, and as you guys keep walking in through that uh, corridor, yeah. what? He has danger sense in dodging. Oh, so you get uh, yeah, you gain. He had it. You, that, but you but didn't. Yeah. You gotta let me know. Yeah. No, no, but I'm saying I was asking that. Yeah, that, that would okay. Yeah, because you can. You, you were able to. Look I'm and trying see to. Remember, it. I remember traps. So. You, you, yeah, you'll get. You'll get. You'll get okay. Uh, you'll start remembering it. Um, and as you guys are walking, where is that? Oh, I must have deleted that one too. Okay, so you guys are able to Perfect. walk, yes. and you guys walk into the. Uh, there's an archway. Uh, leading into a room from that corridor. You guys gonna walk through the, into the archway? Yeah. yeah. All right. As you guys walk into the archway, um, you guys walk in, and you're now back in the room where the two. You guys see a body uh, chained against the wall, dead, hanging on the wall. You guys are back in the room with the harpies. Oh. 
just a big giant circle. square. Yeah, we just went in a giant circle. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I guess we go back <coughs> through this way. Well, what was... That's, so we came through we there, so we should yeah, so have to go back. Yeah. Yeah. All right, okay. so you guys are going to uh, go back. We need to go left next time. Yeah, wherever that T was. It's back where this we, where way, we went, right? and then go the opposite direction. Yeah, we have to go... Yeah, back through the, the way we came into this room originally. Yeah. Are you guys going to... Yeah, so you guys can you guys gonna go through um it goes the straight to the corridor section, right? Yes. Alright, yep, so there's an a T intersection. It's a... How do we get like what's going out of this room? Is it straight or left? because uh, we came in and it was a T all well, the no, Yeah, right? it was a T yeah. 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 Cause there's that, <coughs> we that went, explosion. We went traffic. right. We need to go the other way. Yeah. Oh, because it was the there was the crater. Yeah. Um, yes. So you guys walk back that way, and you guys uh, walk. Uh, you guys are walking down the corridor and see that crater again. Mm -hmm. uh, and it turns to the left, and as you guys uh, move to the left, or you guys head up the corridor, you can see uh, uh, a corridor to your uh, left. But that is the way with it. That was the way you guys came from the kitchen. So you guys are gonna go uh, keep going through the corridor north. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yes. All right. So it's actually quite of a, a ways walk. Walking down this corridor, but you guys finally reach the end where it uh, turns off to the left to another corridor. You're just gonna walk through this corridor. We're just walking the corridor. I'd like to there's walk in circles. Yeah, yeah. yeah. just for, yeah, for time purposes, there's, there's no, there's no turn. Yes. You know I, what? I, I appreciate. I know I, I made fun of you. So I'm gonna skip the whole. You guys turn left, yeah. left thing. So you guys are uh, at the next corridor. You guys come to another T intersection. Um, to your right, uh, you um, kind of see that it uh, kind of branches. Turns over to a uh, port colas, and then to your left is just a, another corridor that turns off to the left. That's the right. Mm -hmm. Well, we went right last time. The one to the right is the door, a port colas door. Is it port port colas cool. is like a wooden, um, it's like a heavy wooden door that you would, it's a sliding, so you'd have to lift it up. <laughs> Let's go um, and lift. Well, I don't see know what is left because what? that seems like it might be important. Yes, yes. So let's maybe go come back to that and then we go left. Okay. And, and then we can come back. Yes. All right. So you guys head to the left and you guys uh, walk that corridor. After you guys are walking for a little bit and do a, tur a couple turns, uh, you guys come to a um, the corridor. There's a uh, door, a wooden door in front of you, and to the right is leads off to another corridor. Whew. Through the door. Through the door. Through the door. All right. So the door is um, un. Uh, unlocked. If you'd like to peek through, whatever you want to do. Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. through me. I'm okay. uh, we'll peek through. Yeah. Which one is going to peek through and sneak? Probably me. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to sneak. Right, give me a stealth check. Ten. Um. <clears throat> yep. You're able just to be able to sneak as you peek through the door. Um. All right. So as you break through the the door, dark energy bursts from the opening. You you start to get very strong. Strong evil, your hairs curl up, you kind of tense up, it's very dark energy. Um, screams and wailing fill the room, as well as words of a dark ritual. Uh, there is a dark purple portal on the east side growing larger and larger. Um, the, there's three uh, cultists uh, kind of knelt down in front of a table with uh, pancreases, stomachs, and hearts. Uh, fire and they're throwing one each by one as they're saying in a chant, Horaino, Horaino, as is the, the portal just growing larger and larger. I think we found the place. <laughs> I think this is a case. <laughs> this, this, this is the, definitely it. It's the big heavy door. <laughs> <one>. <laughs> important one. Yes, there's three cultists. We should try to shoot one and in take the other. Yes. Okay, yes. Yeah, let's, take, yes. Take one out. Do you guys want to try and so sneakily walk in? I'm going yes. to. Yes. Well, so wait, wait, wait. Sneak it, wait. I, I succeeded my well. I succeeded the self roll, so I should just walk inside of there. Yeah. Get the shot off, and then you guys come in. All right. So that we have a surprise on them. All right. So you, uh, you're well, open. Is the there room. only three cultists in the room? Yeah, that's all you can see. All we can see. Mm -hmm. If I walk in further into the room, can I see anything? Like get down low, and like can I see anything else inside? Um, do you want to try and get in the room closer? Just like one step inside the room. Uh, one step in the room, and just I just there's uh, uh, Richard, there's a. Uh, Patterns and drawings on the walls full of blood, um, but there's no other enemies. Uh, books piled, scrolls are pushed everywhere with uh, rich with uh, uh, kind of rules or not rules, but like what I'm trying to think of uh, instructions on how to run the rituals. Mm -hmm. uh, there's blood all over them, and there's like I said, blood patterns, demonic uh, ritual patterns on the wall. 
Oh, you can't see anything else. Okay. So I'm going to attack as I shoot, then you guys come in. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so you're gonna you're gonna go in and attack? Well yeah, whichever one's Alright, so as you me. sneak in and walk in, um they as soon as, well, as you sneak in and walk in, the last one throws the last heart into there yeah. and the ritual stops. Um and the three cultists stand up. A giant three-headed dog emerges from the portal. Each head, he walks in, and then each head comes down and eats. Uh, one just picks up a cultist and eats it. Next one comes down, picks up the cultist, bites it a little bit, blood gushing from the mouth, eats it. Third one comes down, picks up the final cultist, throws it up in the air and eats it. Um, <laughs> the beast oh, turns towards you. <laughs> Ready to strike. Oh no. Roll for initiative. Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck. You were, oh. right. you were right yesterday, I just didn't want to tell you. <laughs> I knew it. This it is the beast that. that I created. It had to be service. Service. Yeah. I did good. I did not. I did not. <laughs> 12. This is a very, very strong beast. Oh <laughs> no. I hope we don't die. Alright, and I'll roll for Peleus oh, and just service. Yes, we did. Well, it's good to use them then before <laughs> yeah, the fight. I have to use an action to use it during the fight. Oh, oh no. Is that a full action? That's a bonus action. Yeah, I was going to try and give you guys more potions, but you guys kind of just went right into the oh, right into the battle. Well, I thought that this was going to be a behind the, the big door. The, the big, big door, door. Yeah. 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 Just and you know, it makes sense. I actually don't door. get to pick which doors are what, so... Uh, well, <laughs> I, I, use a, I use a generator. It would have made more sense, I agree. Yeah. Okay. Just a regular old wooden unlocked door. Yeah. They're not even locked. They don't want to hard to get in the ritual. They gotta go out and use the bathroom, come back in. They don't want it to be hard They're to get in now. The other the room actually does... Poor Coles does make sense. Alright, so... Um, And what, uh, Tadek? 22. Killed it this time around. <laughs> Reinhardt. 6. Making up for all those 1s. <laughs> yeah, 12. Alright. Uh, with initiative, player wins. Um, so, Tadek, your turn. They didn't roll that high. Okay, I was saying for future have, reference. Oh, oh my bad. On? Yeah. Yes, we do. We have the map. You uh, have this, this amazing miniature. It's going to take me a little bit, so just give me a sec. Okay. Mark. Well, since we have a second, uh, lose a marker. <laughs> how did I lose a black frickin' marker? This thing is terrifying. Uh, I don't know how I'm going it's to right deal with right this. From the green dice. I only have fists. Thank you. So. It's literally right in front of you. I'm so excited that you control myself. I'm excited for this uh, fight for a long time. I can't play. He's big. Uh, just punch it in his face. I love to jump. Are you I you do have a very punch? cool miniature for this too. Oh, that's what I'm excited for. Yeah, the miniature. The miniature. Oh, oh, oh. I used to fight beasts like this back in, in the pits. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure you did. I'm sure. Everybody sure. sure. knows who you are. <laughs> this is crazy. Don't you, don't you guess who I am? <laughs> this is nothing. Come on, guys. Everyone knows who he is. This is a simple oh, attack. Dog. Not from what I have seen. <laughs> okay, don't mistake me hitting my shield. For my actual skills. Uh, I'm sorry, I don't have a purple, so the portal's gonna be blue. Ah, oh, right. dang. Breaking immersion now. Come on. Yeah, okay. unplayable. It's purple, come on. <laughs> oh, man. I don't have a big dog, I'm sorry, but this is as close as I can get. Oh, it's it's big. <coughs> if they came with us, if they sold Sur- I looked on they don't sell Surpers. <laughs> don't sell us that. They don't sell Surpers. Miniature. Nope. Somebody make us Concern one. they don't make the creature. <laughs> I had to make it myself. Oh. It's very large. This is their ritual room, they don't screw around, except they leave it up on <laughs> They don't screw around, they just <laughs> leave it open. <laughs> well, when you're summoning something like that... You guys are over here? You can't even go through the door. Unfortunately, your stealth doesn't... 
kind of you kind of jumped into the stealth encounter. Yeah, that's okay. I was like, he's been stealthy. Okay. What? No, was in there. I thought it was regular room. Yeah. Come on. Hmm. What is uh? <coughs> huh? I thought you said dash. Uh, it's double your movement. You have double your movement, but it counts your action. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so yep, first is Tadek. And let's get some bad fight music going. Oh, there's right. <laughs> <clears throat> Okay, oh, well. That wasn't copyright music. I don't know what was actually playing. Well, so. <laughs> unfortunate. <laughs> um, um, <laughs> I'm going to... I'm going to go there. I'm going to throw a dart. Right at his eyeball. <coughs> well, uh, which head? Any of them. Right. The one in the middle. All I right. feel like this has the least likelihood of missing. Alright. Ah, yes! Uh, 25 to hit. Uh, yeah, that's gonna hit. <laughs> 7 damage. 7 damage? Yes. Alright, so you take your dart. And you use your chi and your hand kind of your kai. Ki. Ki. I'm not ready to get this right. I'm just gonna call it kai. Screw your ki. Your kai channels on this dart and kind of glows a blue as you and it launches, stab it in the eyes. It's very angry at this point. And looks at you very angry at this point. Oh no. I was hoping he would not be able to see me, but I forgot he has six eyes. <laughs> yeah. Alright, and after that is uh, Peleus. He is going to. Oh, Peleus is here. <laughs> yeah, he is. He's missing. He's missing. Uh, just have him uh, dash as far as he can go. His <sighs> speed is 30, I believe. Yeah. I think a second. He can go one more. Diagonally. Uh, actually, don't. Yes. Um, move him back two. Okay, thank you. And after Cadius is Cerberus. Oh, oh no. So excited. Alright. Good. <laughs> he's, he's, he's not very he's, he's very big. He does not move very far. He has ten foot movement. Oh boy. So he does not move very far. He's on way, he's a big boy. Yeah, he's, he's a big yeah. Boy. <laughs> it takes I him a while to get around. I am so much faster. Uh, but and now it is Yachty's turn. Okay, uh, that's my bonus action. I'm gonna play Hunter's Mark to him. Uh -huh. Um, and then attack him <coughs> with my longbow. Uh, let's see, 25 to hit. And I did. Yep, that hits. Uh, nine, uh, 15 points of damage. Oh, oh, oh. Holy cow, this is not gonna be as strong as I thought. <laughs> Alright, so. I just got very lucky on those rolls, <laughs> yeah. Oh wow! One point yeah. away from my max. Yeah. It's literally yeah. one less than you could possibly hit. All right. Oh. And so you uh, take your bow and you aim for anything. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna pull out uh, an arrow and I'm gonna draw back and fire at the other eye of the second middle head. All yeah. right. So you pull back and you shoot and it zooms as the. Uh, and he, the middle head kind of notices, looks at you uh, as you uh, draw back your bow, seeing your movement. Looks at you right into his other eye. And it's, it's now completely blind, looking around, can't see, can't figure out why, why can't see anymore. The other two heads look at it, look back at you guys, now very angry. And now we're at the Reinhardt. So is rage an action? Not right now. Right. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna range. Uh, rage. rage is no, do I have no, it's just rage is not action. Do I have uh, like the sprint's mm -hmm. ability? Uh, dash, you can dash, dash, but that rage counts as an action. Actually. Like attack? Uh, yeah, yeah, so if you it doesn't dash, matter because he, he, he can't use extra attack yet, anyways. Also, I'm not gonna have to cop out this fight, I like it. <laughs> Alright, so that's it. That's, that's all he can do. Yep. Alright, uh, back up to the top is Tadek. I'm going to run very fast at him because I am fast. Oh, you gotta be. Are you, are you right up next to him? No, I am. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't look like you I, are. I had 
Who was facing Did you dash or did you just really no, to get there? Okay. I'm very fast, I said that. Alright. Mm -hmm. I am going to uh, I'm going to use a key point. Mm -hmm. I'm going to attack three times. Alright. First one is 21. Second one is 10. It's not gonna hit. And 19. Alright. Uh, so use three punches? Yes, but only two lanes. Yep. Alright. So you Alright, get the uh, 14. Alright. <laughs> Maybe I should just add some more health here. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go with the. Uh, so I use the challenge rating, I choose the encounter rating by uh, Dungeon Master Buck, and I've been using this one's, uh, this one's actually way above that. This is deadly. Yes, wrecked. <laughs> well, he also hasn't hit any of us. Yeah, I feel like I'm not. Uh, yeah, someone's gonna get hurt. All right, so you you go to punch him. You punch his knee. You punch one of the kneecaps on his leg because you can't you, know, you, you can't get very far ahead of him. You punch him in the kneecap. Uh, just kind of hear a crack. It's not broken, but it's, he's kind of limping on it now. Uh, as you go for the as you go for it again, it cracks again. As you go for your third, or that's it. Or okay, so you hit him and then you go to attack and he kind of sidesteps his leg and then you go for the third one. Uh, second, your third attack. <laughs> what is going on? Second or third attack. That's all. <laughs> all right. After that's Peleus' turn. He's gonna move right up next to the beast, oh. and he's going to take his great sword and attack. He misses. Oh. Peleus. And now it is Cerberus' turn. Oh no. And he is very angry I at you for his many knee. Times. Very <laughs> angry. Good. All, all, he both heads look at you. The oh. third head going, <laughs> <laughs> looking straight up in the air. No idea what's going on. The other two. Um, oh no! Let's not use that attack. <laughs> All right. So uh, both one head comes up to to bite you. Both head or one head, the other head. Uh, 13 is the highest. No. All right. So they I'm too fast down for him. You. you do a backflip. The other one comes to it, comes to bite you. Then you slide under that bite. Could be exactly where you were before. So fast. And uh, now after that is Yanni's turn. Okay. So he's I'm gonna kill his beast for you and tits you. I'm going to move a little bit over. It's very bloody. Get, get a little bit close way. to the action. <laughs> so much blood. And fire off another arrow at it. Roll those if I'm rerolling on a luck point. No. My damage? Okay. It's one roll. <laughs> so 26 to hit? No, hit? Yeah, okay. Uh, and then seven points of damage. Alright. So I'm gonna Ooh. pull out of there and, <laughs> and uh, give it a little wink at the end. <laughs> uh, you have to try and hit, are you, do you wanna, which head are you gonna hit? I'm gonna hit the left head, um, going for the eye. Yeah, you guys really you mean you don't You're like trying to blind this thing. No. Yeah, yeah. trying to blind. All right, so you pull back, you, you pull back your bow, and you let it launch with a wink. It looks at you, kind of, <laughs> and right into its eye. <laughs> the other head just kind of notices that it's uh, notice that its uh, other head's been attacked, and you can feel it wincing in pain as well. You feel it you can taste it. You can pain. Very good, these five senses. You can see it. Also, wince in pain as well. And you can just see it. It's just got a couple like arrows yeah. out of its head. And uh, now we're at uh, Reinhardt. Alright, I'm going to run up and I'm going to take a swing at the head that hasn't been damaged yet. You can't reach up there. Okay, then I'm just going to swing at it. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Swing it whenever I can grab. Yeah. Um. So I have eleven. Uh, eleven does not hit. Okay. Oh, did you did you roll advantage as well? Oh no no no! But I did have that. So. Oh, no, that yeah, that is gonna be twenty one. Or yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's gonna hit. Go ahead. Okay, with seven damage, eight, nine, ten. Oh, All right. How do you want to kill this thing? Uh, I want to take a. I want to take a giant swing. And you want to use your Okay, so I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna <coughs> leap off the back of. Is that Tade? Yes. I'm gonna leap off the back and I'm gonna swing. All right. 
So, is, so you uh, do a jump, push, push your right leg off of his shoulder, lean up, do a slice attack, slicing each and every one. Their, their uh, jaws are ready to bite you. Each jaw open as you swing your sword, cutting each of their jaws open. Now, just, now their jaws are limp, uh, cutting their cheeks open. <laughs> you can't bite down anymore. Uh, you drop to the ground. Uh, your sword is all is all bloody. Seems like with a, not a normal uh, red blood, with a purplish blood. Um, the uh, Cerberus, just rattling in pain, turns around and and uh, dashes back into the portal. And, and escapes. Dun dun dun. Uh, you guys. <laughs> Where the shit did it go? <laughs> what was that? <coughs> I ran away. It's not the loud. I've not been giving Peleus XP. <laughs> <laughs> it was uh, 75 for the first two rooms, and then uh, 58. Yes. Yep. Check it So, we are quite strong. We are the strongest. We are the strongest. And I am very fast. I'm surprised we didn't 85? cut that in half. I'm surprised we didn't Wait, take any damage. 75 plus <laughs> yeah. what? 75 and 58. 58. Plus, wasn't there 25 in there? Yeah, that's the 75. 50, oh, 50, 50, okay. 25. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Nice. He didn't write down his experience. He still had one experience. So now I gotta do one. I'll just give him the 300. So yeah. Everyone was right around 300. I think like yeah, 3, 4, I think 3, 13 was the lowest. All right, uh, and you guys gain from this fight. Oh. oh. 250 XP. Oh, Woo! shit! That, uh, some XP. And you hear that's gonna level you guys up, which will level up at the end of the, sh at the end of the stream. Which I think, uh, uh maybe yeah. it's gonna be now. Uh, we'll, we'll let you guys explore a little more before. You sure? Yeah, go through the sport colors. Yeah, I wanna oh, go through okay. that. No, I gotta see what's behind that. Door. Alright, let's see what's behind that. It was a big door! door. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> Does the portal close behind Cerberus? Uh, so I'm gonna get into that here in a second. Okay. Okay. That works as well. Yeah, you're lucky he didn't use his one attack. He would have died. I don't know. <coughs> oh, there, if he could hit me. 66. Yeah. 66 damage? Yes. That literally could, like, insta-kill. Kill. You needed a DC 12 like dex saving me. throw. Oh, you, you, or else you take 66. Well, if you save, you gain. If you get half. My 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 saving throw is six, though. So I'm proficient in it. I was scared. <laughs> if I used that fire, you used it. I, I should have. That's <coughs> it. All right. But it's um, like three d6. Yeah. At yes. that point, he could still kill me, but not insta kill. <laughs> he couldn't even kill me at that. Point. All right. Yeah. So um, as you guys, so as Cerberus runs through the portal, the portal's still open, not doesn't show any sign of sh uh, closing shut. Uh, you guys hear a voice that seems to be bouncing off the wall, seems to be in your head, doesn't feel like you guys are actually listening to it um, physically. It seems to be, this voice seems to be coming from inside your head. Heroes, it's Hypnos. Can you say anything? Hypnos! <laughs> hey, buddy! Did you guys see that? It's we feel good! This. Stop fooling around. This is serious. You guys need to use your powers from the gods to close the portals. But I don't have any powers. Yes, we don't have any powers from the gods. What, what powers? I Each of you concentrate your powers into your hand and, and point it towards the portal now. I don't know what good that's going to do, but okay. Okay, so yep. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's happening. Alright, nothing, <laughs> nothing seems to be happening at this point. Don't you guys know you're the child of the gods? Me? Dude. Who's your guys' goddess again? Because it's not someone Ares. I know. Oh, Peace. there is. Ours is... The moon god. It's Artemis' mother. Okay, okay, Art okay, yeah. So I'll just say Artemis. Sure. For the sake of now. <coughs> we'll, correct, we'll correct it later. Yeah. Okay. Artemis' mom. You, can, you two, the ranger and the monk, you are the sons of Artemis, the goddess of the moon. You, barbarian, are the, are the son of the god of Ares, god of war. Locate your, inner, <laughs> locate your inner demigod, focus. And use your powers to close the portal. I'm going to take the the crescent moon clasp 
from my robe and hold it in my hand and hold it up. <laughs> I'm gonna take my crescent moon necklace off and wrap it around my fingers in my hand. And you and also hear in your head, Son! <laughs> Blood sacrifice to use your powers. <laughs> so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm but, gonna cut my hands. But then I'm also gonna rub the blood on my face. <laughs> on my face. So you know, I'm covered in Double blood. blood. As you guys now, you, you guys pushing your crescent moon towards this portal. You with your cut hands, bloodied with face now, the, the blood on your face. I'm, I'm covered in blood. blood. Yeah, every blood. And so <laughs> all blood. You put your pushing your your uh, with your hands. Uh, Towards the portal, uh, blue shimmering light seems to come out of your guys' hands, hitting the portal as the portal kind of starts to close. Portal's now the portal's now closed. <laughs> ting at the end. Just scoot on its way out. <laughs> ting. All right. Oh, I was more hoping for. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the portal's now closed. Uh, Heroes, there is more portals like this around uh, the Sword Coast region. While we are while we are stopping the gods from taking over Mount Olympus, we need you, heroes, to close these portals, or the world as you know it will cease to exist. I always okay. Okay. It's meant for so, a higher level. How much will you pay us? Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you will be accepted from the glory of the gods. Yeah, that's that's pretty good, yeah. yeah. Great. yeah. And you're saying my dad is Ares? At the end of the war, the gods will finally give you a reward. And you're your father's Ares. <laughs> <laughs> yes! yes. Oh, it's not great! Trash boy is son of God? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wait. <right. laughs> it's, it's our necklace and whatever, his pin's still glowing. Are they now like. Uh, not, not anymore. Just the, not no the more anymore. You guys channeled your uh, demigod powers into it. It's n your your hands are now smoking and your pendants are now smoking. Wait, wait, wait! Before we go, can we do this again? <laughs> yes, it is the power to close the portals. You guys must do it soon, or the monsters will overrun the Sword Coast region and destroy the world. But guys, just the portals, like we can't do bar tricks. Or I must go. Or... Hades is Hades is at the door of Mount Olympus. We have to stop him. Wait, one quick question. Peelis, does he just suck and he's not the mother <laughs> son of anybody? And he he doesn't answer. Oh, okay. Because I didn't remember Peelis. <laughs> Peelis just sucks. Uh, okay, Peelis so sucks. matter of uh, back up, look, Peelis, um, Zeus is, is Zeus. he's Zeus. Yeah. Um, Chosen he, by him. Yeah, so he. Man, I had to come up with this because this was totally not something I think about it. Um, I don't know if what he has a, a lightning bolt. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So he, so we, he, all he has, so what he has to do is, is it's it, up here. He, it's, up it's up here. So he pull, pushes his, uh, or he uh, kind of flexes. Shows, <laughs> he flexes, flexes his, his arm <laughs> towards the portal. His lightning blue uh, tattoo, now glowing blue, shoots out. And now after the, after the, all that, his uh, tattoo is now smoking. Weird. What is my face doing? Do you like the one thing? No, it was just your hands. Am I smoking? No, it's just, the just your hands, hands are smoking. The, your head didn't do anything. Oh. You now blood on your head. Oh. Well, then it'll be people. <coughs> well, hey, this is the first time for everything, right? I'll learn from that. Extra blood does not count. <laughs> Extra blood doesn't count. All right, what are you guys going to do now? Is there anything to you need in the room? room? Um. May I? What the these things? They yeah. search the room. Okay. Those are tables Ooh. with scrolls and books scattered all around them. Can, can I check the thing? Can I take one of the books that had the writings? The uh, yeah, you can't, you can't, you can't see what it says, but you can definitely yeah. take one. Okay, I'm gonna take the book. I'd like to look for other things that are not books. All other right, uh, give me. Uh, you guys are you searching for treasure? Yes. Something you can take. Give me an uh, investigation. <coughs> Nineteen. Actually, twenty. All right. Uh, yeah. So uh, on the table, you're able to look on the table to the left, and you can see a pouch. Uh, and as you open it, there's 20 gold in there. Cool. All right. Anything else? Or just oh, there? no, just uh, nothing else seems of value. You can't read any of the scrolls or the books. Uh, you did take one, but you can't. There's nothing else. Uh, you can't really. I'm going to get someone to translate this later. It might help us later on. If you... I feel that's. The rest right. is not dead yet. He could yeah, come back. Maybe we should go check out that uh, the big, the big door. Guillotine door. Yes. 
port port call. I think that's a great idea. Alright, you're gonna go back important. to um So you guys are gonna go back to the port call store? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so you guys are able to just walk uh, walk out the door again. Uh, you guys go to the uh, the uh, door with the pole call us, and who's going to attempt to uh, lift and open it up? I will. I will try to lift. Why don't you help him? Okay. Yeah, we'll both try to. Yep. Uh, so that's with. Uh, so who's going to actually do it, and who's helping? He will. Yeah. He's going to do it. You're going to help him. So you get advantage. You get advantage from it. No, no, no. This one. That one's better. So wait. Okay. No, that <laughs> is it really bad? Well, what is it? Strength? Yes, so yeah, uh, 15. 15. Okay, that's a strength check. I'm um, sorry, what was that? 15. Uh, <laughs> you are <laughs> unable to lift it. Do you think it was heavy wood? Yeah, it's we, like a thick, wood. thick wood door that you'd have to lift up. All right, so we're not doing we it together? We can break down the door, though. Can I, uh... <coughs> you guys have to break down. Through it. Can I use a key point to use flurry of blows on it and try and uh, break the door? Yeah, roll for attack. <laughs> no! 25. Uh, 1. Uh, no. So you... Uh, and... <laughs> the yeah. one! All right, roll for damage for the 1. Uh, all right, so you're able to, so you kind of go to punch it, does does nothing. Third one, you go to punch it, and it kind of cracks a little bit. Oh, right. let's peer through it. Can I, is, is, can you see through? No, it just cracked. Oh, uh, okay. <clears throat> not all the way through the door cracked, but just the one side cracked. Can I try punching it after he cracked it? Um, you, you can attempt to, yeah. Can we, like, keep punching until we knock it down? Uh, <laughs> for this door, because I want you guys to go through okay. the yeah, yeah. Well, usually so this no. Is, this is, uh, so I'm gonna be just 19. 22. Oh, if okay, you're 19. Punching. <coughs> well, yeah, I'll just punch it for 19. Uh, and if to what, hit. what was your roll? 19. Oh, yeah, so you can hit it. But then what is it, a d4? For unarmed? Uh, you're unarmed, unarmed is technically just one damage, mm -hmm. but... I thought it... No. Yeah, it's 1d4 and you're proficient. No. That's a monk. Martial arts gives you the d4, otherwise unarmed attacks are just one. So then I'll slash no, it with... You can attack more than one. Nope. Not with a bare hand. <laughs> trust, <laughs> me. No, no, trust me, that's the point of martial arts and being a monk. <laughs> I don't look this up, I don't know. Go for it. Yeah. I thought it was proficient. Because it's it, gonna be with, in combat. with martial arts, you get to replace it makes standard it like unarmed yeah. with a d4. Yeah, it makes it stronger. Yeah. Unarmed attacks. I mean, if anything else, I could just I can smash it with my sword. You know, slap, like s try and break it down with my sword. It's one plus your strength modifier. My strength modifier is one. Or two. Um, I'd like to try and break it down with my sword. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> 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 two. Two. <laughs> also <right>. two. <laughs> so you take the pummel of your, of your your pummel of your sword, and you actually you take your shield and you try and bash it, and it kind of cracks a little more, but it's not open. So you can't see it through. Can I try to attack it? With my short sword? <coughs> what was that? Can I attack it with my short sword? Oh, uh, yes, you can. Fifteen. I don't hit. It's ten. It did the one. Four. All right. So it's now, the crack is almost completely across the, so you take your short sword okay. and you attack it, and it doesn't cut it, just... Let then, me go at this again. Why don't all three of us attack it at once? once? We'll all three go at it at once. I'm going to... We can all just, like, it. shoulder check it. Yeah, yeah. Run, yeah. Out. Yeah. run out with our yeah. weapons. Run out with our weapons. Okay, alright. No, just at, uh, if you guys are just going to try you guys want to try and break through it? Yeah, just yeah. Break through no, because you, yeah. get, you yeah. get strength plus advantage. Oh, wait, oh, it's we're not helping with he, would he just do it, or would we all roll? All of us. No, no you don't roll, it's just someone has oh. advantage. It's okay, so then... Nine. Nine. Oh, wait, 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 why don't you guys have Peleus do it? Oh, oh yeah. 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 Yeah, where's Peleus? Peleus? Yeah. Yeah. His yeah. strength is Damn plus Peleus. three. Yeah, so Peleus... Signature like Peleus, Peleus. He'll, put, he'll split this door in two. He'll, he'll cut it in half. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so he... Peleus runs up and... <laughs> just... <laughs> All cracks falling down. But is um, it in half though? No, just in <laughs> oh, half okay. though. Uh, Not so as you guys uh, break down the door, the room smells of burning bodies. 
Scorched armor and weapons litter the floor. A set of rare demonic war masks hang on the north wall. In the northwest corner sits a spine devil muttering to itself in a language you don't understand. Uh, so you guys broke open the door of the creature, as you guys broke it open, the creature <laughs> turns over towards you. Everyone roll for initiative. Oh. Blood bites. Shit. Ooh. <coughs> I am very... I think I've gotten seven two or three times this time. Well, I got two ones. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I have very consistent rolls. <laughs> it's, it's one thing multiple times. It's either really high or really low. <laughs> it's either a 19, 20, or a 1. <laughs> that's, uh, that's how my rolls go. At some point, Blue had said, smoking is bad for your health. It's one plus strength modifier, I believe. And then he said, oh, no, shit. Smoking is bad for your health. Sorry, I, I, I was, I was kind of really intact with that encounter, because I've been waiting for that for oh, two shit, weeks. Oh, shit, he said. Oh, yeah, Something. the masks, yeah, the demonic masks, um, they seem to be kind of tattered. And there's two of them. Huh? There's, you said two? Uh, demonic okay. masks, It's. it seems like one piece, um, like a one piece of a... Um, just one piece, but it's all three masks are, uh, like, one, and then the other one's on top, and that one's on there. Okay, so there's three masks, but that are, like, like all on top of each other. Yeah. Okay. okay. It's okay. one item, but the three masks. Oh. Yeah. Okay. And they're rare. Yeah, they're rare. Mm. Looks more like a decorative piece. It doesn't look like something you'd wear. Oh. Sounds like something we could sell. sell. I mean, you could definitely like craft them up the heart them, heart yes. if you want to. Or you could sell them. Yeah, so we should probably do this. After we deal with them. Yeah, after we deal with this After guy, we yeah. try making it into armor. <laughs> no. You make sort of shoulder pads? No, I want it's shoulder pads I just, masks. Honestly, I just want to wear the mask. I'll put it. I put one well, you can make on each of my ass cheeks. Shoulder pads, and you have make one extra for a mask. Football. Ass protection and one for the crotch. Butt cheeks. <laughs> Butt cheeks and crotch Face protection. Face cheeks. <laughs> All right, Tadek. Uh, twenty-two. Pelia's got four. Reinhardt. Seven. How far you got? Six. Reinhardt. Seven. Yeah. Nine. All right, Tadek goes first. Yes, he does. Uh, uh, we are all right here. Uh, we all just... He broke the door and we're all... <coughs> right there. At the... Uh, just put it, I don't know. Whatever. Uh, don't kick me out. What? I'm going to stand right under the masks. Um, actually go halfway into the room. All right, so you just go halfway into the room. Uh, you kind of hit a, a stone thing on the floor, and it kind of concaves a little bit. And all of a sudden, fire from either side of the room comes into uh, comes in to hit you. And uh, give me a uh, dexterity save. Fourteen. Uh, yep. So uh, the, four the so the fire comes and you slide forward back to where you were <coughs> and now you're okay. ready to go yes uh, the, and as you slide forward uh, as you, you just fire goes back okay so very very scary fire I'm going to punch the demon two times <laughs> all right roll for attack <gasps> whoa <laughs> two twenties natural natural twenty and a seventeen uh, yeah, both are gonna hit. So, <laughs> wow. Uh, <laughs> uh, for the first one, it'll be 10. For the yeah. second one, it'll be 7. So 17 total. Alright. Damn. Three crits in one <laughs> game. So, the, so you run up to the, you do a slide, get up towards the creature, <laughs> punch him twice. <laughs> Creature kind of backs up a little bit. Further into the corner. 
All right, and after that is the uh, demon's turn. Oh, he's here right next to it, doesn't have to move, so he's going to. Um, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. He's going to. All right, so he's, go so <laughs> he's going to uh, bite at you. Ah. Or, yeah, he's going to bite at you. And then use. Uh, and he's gonna bite you and then use his pitchfork to attack you. Oh, he's a pitchfork? <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? Where did that come from? Alright, so the bite is 20 to hit. That hits. Uh, 4 to 6 is okay. That does not hit. Alright, so for the bite. Four. I have another one of you. Where are you at? Alright, that's two plus one is three plus oh. nope, just three. Just three. Three damage. So he <laughs> takes a bite out of your arm and goes to stab you with it as you rattle in pain and misses and you get back up right and fight. Ah! Oh! <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Alright, and uh Does it next... look infected? <laughs> that doesn't look good, brother. Next is uh Yachty. Okay. Um I'm going to Remember to pick up my freaking arrow! <laughs> oh my like, gosh, dang it! It's alright, I've got plenty. I'm gonna attack it with my bow. 12. Oh. Uh, nope. Ah, dang it. Alright, so you take dang. an arrow out, ready to attack it, and the creature kind of barely misses. That's all. This little guy is also very fast. <laughs> all right, and uh, after Yadi is Peleus. He is going to try and run. Um, time out. Yep, Peleus is going to try and run up and try to disable. Use his action to try and disable the trap. Oh, the trap is still there. I don't know how good he is at that, so uh -oh. <laughs> I'm not going to let Peleus get torched because he's not here. Um, you let him get towards it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, oh, his uh, he character sheet's him. really weird. <laughs> is it the same? It's the same as ours. Yeah, yeah it is. is. It's slightly different. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks weird. Alright, um, I'm trying to find his... Oh, there's his slide hand. Ooh, yeah, he doesn't. <laughs> he tries to disable it, doesn't work. Oh, no. Well, it looks like he's uh, stopped dead in his tracks. And after <laughs> Helios <laughs> is <laughs> Reinhardt. Okay, so I'm also going to charge and try and dodge the fire. Oh, okay. Dodge. You're not raging, so you won't get uh, advantage. But, uh, yep, so you, in the, as you step, you place on just like a square of tiles, and then they all go under, and, and roll a dexterity saving throw. But I do get advantage, because I have danger sense. Yes, because you did see this coming. Yes. Uh, <laughs> you did see this coming. 15, and then... That's gonna, that, you're able to uh, dodge, slide, right, and so slide, right and then move, and attack. Okay, so... Oh! Yeah, nat 1. That's great. <laughs> so 4. No. Oh, you got a nat 1? Yeah. Yep. Okay, so as you uh, slide, and you go to attack, as you slide, you kind of scrape your knee, take 1 d4 of damage. You slide, scraping your knee, uh, rattling in pain. You still try to attack, but it's very mis a misguided attack and completely misses. <sighs> <sighs> All right, and after uh, Reinhardt, we're back at the top with Tadek. Yes. I think this is the most difficult uh, any minutes to Yeah, so far. Yeah. Two punches, once again. Uh, 16 and 12. Uh, 16 will hit. Five. Damage. Alright, damage. You sure this was not the secret yes, boss? Just <laughs> enough to kill him. Oh! Alright, so as you, uh, you throw your punch first, it grabs your first punch. Right, it just grabs your punch, and as you go to your- happy about this. As you go for your second one, you punch him right in the face, and it just- <laughs> And then falls over. Smash his face. <laughs> He's All a right. demon. He deserves to die. <laughs> That's the uh, end of the combat. Alright. Um, Can I steal the mask off the wall? Uh, I'm closer. <laughs> yes, you guys are yeah, you're definitely able to uh, we'll take the demonic war mask. Can we? <coughs> yeah. Let's before, search before the... Before you put it away, can I try and put it on? No. 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 It might be cursed. 
Okay, it's a good point. Can I use a? Uh, can I do some sort of check to see if it's cursed? Is that a religion? Would it be a religion? Because I have that. What was that? To, to see if it's cursed. Now that's our. That's our cannon. Arcana. Arcana? Well, yeah, that would make sense. It's arcana. It's arcana. Oh. For magic search. Uh, yeah. Just, I mean, give it a try. Just, oh, yeah, just see if it doesn't hurt. Yeah. Nine. Uh, you're, you it just looks like an item to you. You can't tell if there's any magic or not into it. Well, either way, I, I mean, don't I'm think already he's not, holding he's a not going to let me. Cerberus ritual and the mask. So if anything bad happens, just it'll happen just, just to me. Yeah, he's yeah. already not going to let me wear it. But yes, I'd like to search the body. All right. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> investigation. <laughs> Seven. Uh, you're not able to really find anything on the on the enemy. Is there anything else in the room? There's a bunch of armor and weapons. Uh, yeah, yeah, perception yeah. check. And I do want to do okay. Ten, and then twelve. Um, so the I, so the um, the weapons and the armor on the ground uh, seem too scorched to be even be used. They're all pretty damaged uh, from the, from the uh, fire. Um, and but you do see uh, gold littered on the floor. Uh, that seemed to be maybe it was the pouches that they were held catch, caught on fire. Um, but you're able to find uh, eleven gold pieces. Uh, what'd you roll for perception? Twelve. Okay. I'm going to try to. There's nothing uh, else. Uh, I'm going to try to disable the trap. Okay. Uh, so that we don't have to slide a man check. Sixteen. All right. Yep. You're able to uh, find the uh, wire that it goes to. You just hey, silly pillow. Cut it. <laughs> you do not do that. You don't have Zero. weapons. You just, you just break it. I just break the wire with my bare hands because <laughs> I'm very fast <laughs> and very strong. All right. And this. What else are you guys gonna do? It's all down here. Yeah. Yeah. Is there any? Were there any pathways we didn't go down? Um, there are a couple of them. You guys haven't gone. Yeah, I think there has to be. Oh, I'm just trying to. One room you haven't gone to. I don't. Oh, well, I, I don't know where that room would be. So uh, we we would just want to like wander. Because I feel like wasn't there a path? That, there there was like a. We could it's turn not left. Where you guys are think it's at? Oh, I thought there was a part where we could turn oh, left. Oh, duh. Or it's the door down the, it's the Cerberus door. Because there was a pathway, wasn't there? And there was a pathway to continue. Yeah, yeah we didn't continue. We just stopped at the oh, door. Well, there two rooms. Yeah, there's two rooms you guys have gone. Oh. So you guys want to go to that room? You guys, so, yeah, you guys know would know the general idea is. where that's at. I know where that is. You wouldn't know where the general idea of the other one is. Let's go okay. to that one then. Yeah. Okay, you guys want to go ahead and go to that one? Yes. All right, so as you guys uh, walk up to the door, Will be a pretty easy one. We're going to end it after this. More traps. <laughs> unless you guys, unless you guys want to try and find the last room. We didn't go through the door in the very main room. There's one door that. Yeah, that is correct. We did. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, because there were three Alan. doors. There were yeah. three doors in the main room, yeah. and we only went down two. Yeah. Or it was the one that was locked. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. That we didn't get through. Alright, so as you guys walk up to this door, you guys try and open it, it is also locked. Oh, I'm gonna try and unlock it. Uh, who wants to try and slide he hand has as well? the hand? He has hand. the. <coughs> oh, yeah. Uh, slide a hand. 22. Uh, yeah, Wait, you're no, able. that's not right, it's plus 2, it's 18. Doesn't matter, you, you're definitely able to Definitely unlock. unlocked it. Alright, uh, you're gonna open the door? Uh, yeah, let's just crash it. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Just, you know, straight oh, up. Yeah. Open it? Just walk around. Alright, so as you just open up the door, the room's, uh, the room smells of stale piss and shit. Yeah. Oh, stale great. piss and aged shit. Four deep <laughs> holes uh, line the north floor where the stench seems to be coming from. <laughs> Someone has scratched beware the rats on the east wall. Feces, feces is streaked uh, along the floor. Like the hole closest to the west wall seems to have a hint of a shine to it. Yeah, let's go look at yeah, that. Let's go check that out. Let's go check that out. Yeah, go ahead and roll investigation. Um, I've got one point left. I got one more point left. Seven. Seven. <laughs> highest was seven. Thirteen actually was the highest. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, because you teach your last one. Yeah. Um, so you are just rummaging through this. You walk up to this hole. That, as you're walking up, the shimmering, the shimmering light, the shimmer kind of, you lose the shimmer. Mm -hmm. and, and then you walk up to it. As you're reaching through this hole, just, just full of shit <laughs> and piss. Um, oh, hi. Duh. LW Dominator, what's up, man? What's up, Welcome dude? to the stream. So as you're just I, riding I, through the shit dominate. and piss that's in this hole, <laughs> yeah. you can't really seem to find. The hole goes pretty deep, but you don't seem to find what was Shiny. shimmering. Well, congratulations, you've just dug through a bunch of shit. <laughs> uh, also, I for no more. No, don't touch me. Make a, uh, I'm very fast. You can't, you can't do this. Constitution saving throw. Uh, six. <laughs> Six. Yeah. All right. So as you're rummaging through this, you <laughs> get really, you start to get you start to feel sick. Take one d4 damage. You throw up so hard that it hurts. <laughs> See, you, you said that going through trash was bad. I lost spend. more health right now digging through <laughs> shit than I have this entire time. So you are just covered in shit. You two, and a lot of these priest clothes. You walk back to them to kind of tell them there was nothing there, and they are just looking I'm at you, pulse. and you smell so bad. Uh. <laughs> Sorry guys, I, I don't know what to tell you. I saw something shiny. I wanted, I wanted it. I saw it. Probably the ridicule. I make my hands on, on the cultist like robe and then take it off and. You still it smell it. like shit. That's okay. That's, you you don't actually have shit on your hands now, but you still smell awful. <laughs> That's okay. At least I don't look awful. Well, that bad. I still have a bunch of blood on my face. Oh, you're killing me. LW Dominator. I love D and D. Yeah, no, it's the best. Oh, I love D and D. It's, yeah. oh, it's amazing. The role play and everything. I love it's it. It's so sad. All right, so you guys gonna try and find the last room? Yeah, or? yeah let's try it. Okay. Well, uh, so yeah, it, you guys kind of figured it out. It wasn't the, the beginning. Door. It wasn't door. the very beginning uh, room that you guys were in. Uh, through that. Uh, uh, um, yeah, through the in the locked door. And uh, if you guys came back, I will allow you to try and think it again. Okay, go ahead. Drop uh, whammies, the whammies. Seventeen. <coughs> um, yeah, you're able oh, to um, unlock it. You guys can go ahead and open it and go through. Yes. Yeah. All right. So as you, uh, who's going first? Um, you might pick the lock. lock. Yeah. yeah. All yep. right. So as you walk in, you take one step, and you kind of hear a trigger and oh. spikes. Fling up from the uh, from the oh, floor sucks. and give me a. I'm gonna take all my damage. Oh, it's not even a not even a saving throw. Saving you just take one d10 piercing damage Ooh, oh, as the spikes shoot up your leg. Shit, guys! Only two points damage though. <laughs> it just looks crazy or something. He's so little. Yeah, he's they, so all the skinny. Spikes up, like, the the spike straight, going straight, like straight up your straight up yeah. your leg and then just come right back down. Okay. So you now take your foot, you bring it back in pain. Be careful of that, guys. I'm going to uh, try really to disarm hurt. that trap. All right, go ahead and give me a slide of hand check. Which die I want to use. This one. <laughs> yes. 22. All right, yep. Yeah, you find the, the wire that connects to you, you snap it, and then you snap all wire, and then you want to try and go through it. I'll try again. Are there any other traps? I'm going to step on that, and then... Yeah, we should probably look at traps. <laughs> Is there a search for traps? Are you doing an investigation check? <sighs> I always have such terrible investigation rolls. <laughs> 20! Oh, oh no! Oh, no! Oh, yeah. 22 yeah, traps! There are no more traps! <laughs> oh, dang it! <laughs> you really made the same thing. Well, at least no, we definitely know. <laughs> Alright, so uh, as you guys walk through this corridor, um, you guys just uh, you guys reach the end of a very long corridor, turning left. As you turn left down this corridor, um, a fountain of dark, murky water sits in the alcove. An alcove is just kind of like a an indent into the wall where it's kind of like a small, uh, just an indent, looks like a small little showcase. Um, and a uh, fountain sits there. Like a fountain, just like a, a water, a water so fountain, murky, special murky about this water. Water of murky water. Does it smell like shit? I just, <laughs> it, just <laughs> it doesn't smell like anything. There's not a stench to it. Is it special is it water? Is fountain? Uh, give me an investigation. Guys, what are you? Four. Uh, you you kind of put your hands in there, but you can't find anything. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna get entirely special. in the fountain. Can I get entirely in the fountain? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get in the fountain and wash the shit off of me. 
Okay, so you're okay. going to completely submerge yourself yeah, in the water? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, so as you completely submerge yourself, a little bit of water gets in your mouth and make a... <laughs> Great. I don't know if this is the... Good. Constitution saving water. Oh, oh, this yeah. is the poop water. <laughs> this is five. <laughs> five. Alright, so uh, you now become poisoned. Oh. <laughs> Dang it. Oh my uh, god. <laughs> you said you have a uh, healer's kit? Yeah, what? Uh, I, I a creature has disadvantage on attack rolls mm -hmm. and ability checks. Hold on. But how do I cure the poison? Uh, I would like to try to heal him with my his healer's here, kit. Here, quick, take this. Uh, you, can, you can try and uh, try and make him non-poison with the healer's kit. Ooh, 23! Yep, you're able to yes. heal him. <laughs> ha -ha! I am no proficient no in medicine. No longer poison and I no longer smell like shit. <laughs> Double whammy. <laughs> Win win. So what else is in the room? Uh, Alright, so that's that's, that's you it. just saw that and as you guys just the corridor keeps going. You guys can keep going? Yeah. 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 Alright, so as you guys keep walking down the corridor. Good not hug. Uh you guys turn make another turn, you guys see withered corpses are nailed to the uh, cool. corridor walls. Oh yeah. Uh, it smells very, very, very bad as he's uh, it smells like these yeah. bodies have been here for a very long Being time. Very Skin decayed. Religious man that I am, I'm going to Unpin the bodies from the wall because that's no way for a. Uh... All right, we're gonna we're gonna put up. I mean, you got quite a bit of space in the corridor. Uh, is the, what's the floor made of? Uh, just stone. Stone. Um, I'm going to put them into. I mean, a a spot that we're not at. My cousin is my cousin's. Uh, well, that's a lot. Wow, that's a, what a great name. What kind of character is it? Is an epic name for an orc. They were, they were talking about, uh, so I, LW Dominator has uh, a character, so he asked oh, okay. what his name, or told him what his name was, <coughs> and they were talking about their character. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, yeah, so, um, I'm sorry, like what, right I'm going to put them into an area that we're not going to be walking. Uh, uh, you're, uh, yeah, yeah, so it's long enough, you can just kind of set them to the side. Yes, in the okay. side, and I'm going to, uh, actually I'm going to set them outside of the corridor in the, the main room. And I'm going to... Uh, you would have to walk quite a distance Oh, it's, back. it's, it's, it's way it's back. Your, okay. your... I will hit them on the way back then. <laughs> okay, that sounds good. Okay, Thank I you. will put, I will lay, line them up neatly, and then we will continue. Alright, so you guys walk down the corridor, make a couple turns, and you guys come to another portcullis. Oh shit. Ah, shit. This, right, one, try you, this one you guys are not going to be able to break open, you guys are going to have to lift okay. it. Alright, I'm going to try You can at least try once to, to break it open. Yeah, we're both going to do it. So, are you going to break it or are you going to lift it? Lift, lift. it. Actually, lift? Peelis is going to do it. Alright, Peelis. Yeah, me and Peelis. Yeah. Well, Peelis is going to roll for it. Because Peelis uh, is right. the best thing. He's rolling for it. Oh, okay. Nope. And with advantage... Yep, he's able to yes. get his hands under it and lift it. And now... Kilo's gentle touch has done the trick. <laughs> Alright, so you guys lift open the door to find one specter rushing towards oh, you shit. from the back of the room. A collapsed stone staircase descends towards the southeast corner of the room. The rocks seem to have been there for many years. Uh, whatever's under the floor has been locked away for centuries. Uh, an anvil and weapon sharpener sit in the northwest corner of the room along with a, lar with a forge in the middle. The heat from the forge is making the room very hot and smoky. Due to the smoky atmosphere, all ranged attacks in this room have disadvantage. Sheep. And let's me try. right up the room real quick. I'm assuming this is the monster that the... <coughs> yes. That we talked about earlier. What? Which one? When I, when I asked you earlier if there was a monster that uh, was resistant to normal types yep. of attacks, he said Spectre. I was like, well, this is the one. <laughs> Actually, I'll wait for you to get, up, get that up, and then I'm going to go around. Okay. Yep. Uh, one more second. Are you getting another drink? I'm going to the bathroom. Okay. That's what to say. You have a couple of you in Right. 
Now, come on. There you go. Now you can oh. do your thing. Go through the. Uh, the dungeon? The dungeon here. Oh, you can see it. <laughs> Alright, that's all the camera. Up here. Actually, I think they're all on camera. So they, they like my butt. They love your butt. They love your butt. My butt is very nice. Very nice, I work it out. Do some butt crunches. Yeah, Alright, so this, is, this is the forge here, and then the anvil, and the weapon sharpener, and the spectre. That is just right, right, right in the face. Uh, he's actually back here. So he's, he's coming, coming up towards you. And roll for initiative! Oh. It's a boy. Well, what do you roll? 23. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh! <laughs> just, not, not quite as good as me, though. I just, I just oh, rolled by the way, way, for that uh, spined uh, devil. Oh, yeah. Okay. Remember next scene. Resistant to attacks, animated fun, because range attacks have disadvantage. Well, none of us have magic weapons, so... <coughs> the specters are also stupid. Oh, really? This is, this is the one thing that I was super scared about. Oh, you rolled a 19. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I rolled you a 19, Busted. but 20, 22 is your initiative. I rolled your best initiative. Yeah, so far. You. Okay, I rolled 12. Ah. And this is not the order we would be in here. So it is. What what type of uh, creature in here? Tonic. Spectre. Well, Spectre is like a. It's like a an evil ghost. Like it looks like a banshee, but it's not a banshee. It's hmm. it's less ghost. Have you played the Witcher? Well, it's yeah, a wraith. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's, yeah. It looks like a wraith. Yeah. Which means I probably can't hit it with my sword. You can. Yeah. It's just it's just resistant, okay. which means it takes half damage. So imagine hitting it with. <coughs> in The Witcher, imagine hitting a wraith with a steel sword while it's not trapped by Irden. Okay. Well, that's you said a lot of Witcher. Very, very I, do, I, I played like 80 hours and then uh, uninstalled it to make space for Hey, bro, if I create a campaign on Roll20, would you and your friends like to play? Depends on when it was. On our off time. Yeah. yeah. I'd be down. That'd be a lot of fun. Yeah, we'd be totally down. Um. Special or do you have, does each everyone have to play pay for roll twenty though? No, but everyone has to just be on the computer. I have all just like better roll twenty. Yeah, yeah, I'd be yeah, you know, I I would be yeah. It sounds yeah, like we're going down for that. That's an awesome idea. Um, all right, Tonic, you're uh, twelve. Twelve. Uh, Reinhardt. Uh, well, it was twenty. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Okay. Yeah. Twenty-three. Ooh, that's a good one. That is good. All right, uh, up to first. Yeah. Can I get up to him? Oh, it's free. Is that awesome. I'll start like, working on the story. Like, it's not actually awesome yet. That's, yeah. that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Just get me all the way up to him. I'm going to put a Hunter's Mark on him with my bonus action. I'm going to attack him with my so short sword. You down. That's a uh, 19 to hit. Uh, that'll hit. And uh, 13 points of damage. Did you roll disadvantage? Uh, it's my sword. Short, short sword? Okay. Yeah. 13 points of damage. If you need to need D6, let me know. You got plenty. <laughs> well, when I was a rogue, stealth attack was d6, so All yeah, right. I had to roll a bunch of them. And Reinhardt. Okay. Um, I'm going to come up on this side. And uh, yeah, James, if you just want to message uh, Josh and kind of let him know the details once you get a start, once you get a uh, campaign going, you can kind of talk to us about it and we can definitely get that started. Cool. 16, 19. That'll hit. But the. Uh, well, I guess five, two point five damage. This is half, right? Well, you five damage, and then he'll mess with it. Oh, okay. So five damage. He rolled five. 
Okay, so I'll just do, I'll give you, uh, round it up. You don't have to yeah. tell us. Damn but okay. yeah, it's round it up. Okay. Alright, so you, uh, take your sword and you kind of hit it. it. You kind of feel a little bit of resistance as it goes through, and its body dissipates, and then warms back together. And after Reinhardt is... Oh, I keep looking at the wrong one. Um, got it. Cool. It's going to... I'm going to get behind it. Because I'm very fast. <laughs> and the roll for attack. Punch it twice. Did you roll another 20? Yeah, oh 20. my goodness! Nat nice 20! Dude, you need to go get a lottery <laughs> ticket. And then 10 to hit on the second one. Uh, no, the second one doesn't hit, but you you do your falcon punch, you go into a stance, your uh, fist lights up blue. Eight. And you... <laughs> and, uh, eight damage? Yes. How do you want to kill it? Uh, I'm going to... You know what, I'm going to do the classic, I'm going to uppercut it, but my fist will go through it. Uh, I'm just going to punch it in half. <laughs> I'm yeah. just going to, yes, uppercut it from the bottom to the top. Alright, so as you your uh, fist starts to turn blue, you kind of do like a, a little bit of a duck and you reach up with an uppercut fist and uh, your you body dissipates and then slowly fades. That's right. That's right. With a, with a oh, and then I'm on the other side. Hey. Sounds awful. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <Hey>. Brother. <laughs> all right. And you all get oh. more XP. Did I miss XP? Well, yes. Yeah. Yeah. How much? Uh, 112. Whoa. For the, the spiny thing. <coughs> okay. The devil. Jeez. It was at 450 XP divided by 4. <laughs> Rush. You can hit the first few levels really fast. Uh, this one, um, uh, 50 XP each. 50? Yep. 52. What's level 4? <laughs> What's the XP level 4? I think it's 900. Ah, oh, oh, shit. Well, we'll, we'll kind of run into that because you guys, this is kind of, uh, Alright, so uh, as you guys uh, uh, kill the specter, what else are you guys going to do now in this room? Uh, I think you guys should use the, the sharpening stone and the anvil to enhance your gear. Okay. Can we do that? It's not going to enhance it, I mean, it's just gear just noticeably sharp. It just makes your oh, weapons oh, noticeably okay. sharper. Okay. Well, uh, this I would love to make yeah, with the forge. noticeably sharper. You know what? Can we do anything with the mess in the forge? Burn it. Try. Do not try to do no, it. Fire. We're not hands throwing hands it in the fire. Is no. there anything else in this room? Anything that looks shiny? Uh, give me an investigation check. Uh, fifteen. Uh, nothing in the room. In the yeah, forge. The room. Nothing in the, like, the room or the forge. Oh. No. Oh wait. Yes. Wait, what? what? Yes, there is. I forgot oh. about this. I was going to say the specter, but it's dissipated. Um, so, as, so as you're looking around, uh, next, to the, next to the forge on the side, uh, you see a, a pouch. Take the pouch. All right, as you open the pouch, you find four turquoise gems. Ooh. Ooh. Fancy. Yeah, fancy. I will put them like in my <laughs> Along with 16 silver uh, copper pieces in there. What? 16 silver copper pieces? <laughs> 16 silver copper pieces. What are those? Silver They're copper. like half <laughs> silver, half <laughs> copper. It's really neat. It's double the value. <laughs> These are the rare. rare. <laughs> a rare commodity. <laughs> All right. Uh, as you guys are just kind of idly standing there, kind of waiting for if you've picked up your things, uh, the temple starts rumbling. Um, the... Uh, the temple just starts rumbling and things are the ceiling just starts to <laughs> crash. We're going break. to run back in. Yes. Uh, everyone, give me here. a deck saving throw to oh, see if you guys shit. can get out in time. Oh my god. Uh, <sighs> Ooh, yeah. You can see it happening, so you do get advantage. Yeah. 
That 20? Oh my goodness. Go on, lock it to you. Uh, six. That's all right. It's an easy. Yeah. So is that six, Matt? That's a lot. Keep a count on the video. All That's right. Yep. So you guys are. Uh, you guys. So as the walls are crumbling, you guys notice are darting. You guys remember your guys' way. You guys run up. You guys find the ladder. You guys climb up the ladder. The uh, uh, temple is falling. You can hear uh, towards um, kind of the back. You can start to hear the whole the whole temple just collapse, <laughs> loud crumbling as you guys uh, get up towards the. Uh, um, you guys. Uh, yeah, you guys climb up, and you guys are right outside the city hall, the, uh, the hall of uh, justice. 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 And you guys are out, and that's where we're gonna end the campaign. Oh, not the campaign. No, that's the campaign. Not we're gonna end the session here with that.